All right, mic check. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Nerds of the Side of Fries, where we talk all things pop culture, movies, and video games. I'm your host, Mads. I'm Senya. And I'm Intern. And I have a question for you. <laughs> oh, God, is where I get roasted? Based no, no, on no, no. This, is, a, this no, is more no, of a no, what no. if. Okay. You're in the middle but of a forest. We know the answer. In the middle of a forest. We know the correct answer. No. Want me to ask it? Yeah, you remember it better than me. Okay. Okay. It. Would you allow your future daughter or, or your son, it doesn't matter, to be in the woods with a man or a bear? Oh. Think about it. A man? There's or not much to think about. Yeah. No, no, no. There's much to think about. Man or a bear? Man or bear. Which one are you choosing? Who do you... Who do you... <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Man or a bear? What yeah. type of man is it? There's no, no you specific can't. You can't ask questions. You don't know nothing about either. It's a grown-ass man and a grown-ass bear. That's it. I'm going to go with the bear. Thank you. Really? Smart. 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 <laughs> this, Why? This became a whole okay, thing on TikTok. So it's Explain this, this to thing. me. Well, it, turn? It, it started off. The fact that I had to ask what kind of man it was. Yeah. Damn. Yo, yeah. But it started off as a video of a guy on TikTok, and there's like a bear coming up to him, and the guy's like, that's far enough. And the bear turns around and leaves. Yeah. And then a girl stitched it to a video of like, oh, a bear can do that. And a guy is just yelling at her, following her. Oh. And she's like, stop following me, stop following me. And yeah. the guy's just chasing after her. Wow. So then it became, would you <laughs> leave your kid in the, in the woods with a man? Oh, my god. Or a bear? Damn. What did I you say? say? I thought about it for a second. And, and then, then I talked to him about it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so my first answer was he like. Said, man i said man so quick no. but i was like because not because i don't know who the man is but because my child will be trained <laughs> 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 which is like something no one has thought about but i'm like but even then if like say they i couldn't have the chance to like my child wasn't trained in anything mm -hmm. bear <laughs> yeah and then overthinking it more and talking about but it more see bear it's a it's a tricky question because some I've seen some videos where bears don't give a fuck. No, no, no like, yeah, yeah. That's but mostly when they're here, hungry. This is this is my justification, and there's like comments. Exactly. What on if TikTok? we get end up with the hungry bear? But well, if you end up with a man, it's just. FBI, open up! <laughs> <laughs> okay. But like my justification is okay. You're in the woods. Your kid, whoever. Yeah. That is a bear's home. And you're lost. Like, oh, you were camping. Mm -hmm, yeah. What the hell is a man doing? And he found you. <laughs> he was following that's, you. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. a good point. And then people were like, um, at least if the bear eats me. Um, he just eats me and I die with dignity. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my god. Or they're gosh. like, he'll, he'll know I was a person. Damn. What or the? And they were like, if I told people a bear attacked me, they'll believe me. Wow. <laughs> it it, became it a got whole very thing. deep. It and very got very deep. And we also saw this other TikTok See, where a woman tells, a, tells his her husband about it. And the husband's like. And he finally understands, like, oh, my God, I finally see the fear you guys live with. <laughs> yeah, she asked him. She's like, when was the last time you were fearing for your life? He's like, like, he didn't. He was like, oh, like, never. Yeah. He's like, what about you? She's like, when I got to, when I got gas yesterday. Yeah. And he's like, oh, my God, I'm so sorry. Like, I mean, see, this also, like, makes <laughs> me kind of sad. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, it's like the way we see <laughs> men in our society. It's like, wow. Because I know there are, we know a lot of good men. Yeah, but there's not yeah, all. But of them. Even I, I don't trust men. <laughs> okay, but then here, what, this was the next question. I'm gonna just do it really quick. Okay, would you leave your kids in the woods with a bear or a man you know, but you can't pick? A man you know, but, but you, you can't pick. You can't pick him. It's just you know the man, but you don't know. Oh. You don't know. You don't know which one. You don't know if he's and uh, you don't know which if he's one of your uncles, one of your friends, cousins, or anything. You just know it's mm -hmm. a man you know, but that's it. Would you can't pick them? Or would you leave them with the, or bear? the bear? I would still choose the bear. Not because I have any bad pe you. any bad men in my life. It's Thank just who no you don't <laughs> <We're sticking laughs> <That's> it. It. <laughs> You have to hit it good or yeah. no, it won't choke. I was hitting the side that time. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Fuck you. That was the perfect sound. <laughs> it slipped. <laughs> <laughs> you dumb fuck. Okay. You dumb fudging but yeah. dog. Uh, all right. That was a question. That was that was, that was it a good, really makes we should, you think. We should we should start one of those off every time. Well yeah. it's hard to you're really not a question. We'll we'll start off like we'll bring some of those this back with we'll bring up other right topics. Now. This yeah, is yeah, the yeah. question of the week. But it, it's a good it made me open my eyes to like a lot. Like, okay, I you're see welcome. it now. I see it now. You're welcome. You see, you see I would it? take the bear too. <laughs> <laughs> like if I was a girl in that situation, I'm I'm talking to that bear. Yeah. <laughs> Disney movies have showed me if I sing loud enough, he will leave. <laughs> <laughs> my first thought when I saw mm -hmm. the thing was like, well, 
at least they won't ask me now what I was wearing with them bare. Oh my yeah. god. That was my first time. Like, well, they won't ask me what dude. She told me I was like, wearing. oh my god, she's right. She's fucking right. They won't ask her what she was wearing. They won't ask her what she was doing. They won't ask her what she said to the man, how she looked at the man, nothing. It'll just be like, the bear got your ass. Damn, that's sad. <laughs> and that's only if the bear's right out of hibernation. That's when they're really hungry. But if not, yeah, then but the again, bear might like just a bear, leave. If you don't mess yeah. with the bear, they won't mess with you. But a man? For the most part. But a man? I'm just yeah. like, well, outrunning wise, you could outrun the man maybe, but the bear you don't outrun. But even then, the bear is still a safer option. I died with dignity. And that's all that matters. You at least fed. <laughs> you fed. You fed nature. You fed nature. You fed nature. That's you how you get, go out. You didn't get fed into some perverted dreams. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, not all men. Not all men, okay, of course. But, but in this situation, you're in the woods, and he was just there. Like you're chilling and you see a bear. Yeah, yeah, true, true. And then all of a sudden I would you not turn trust any man. <laughs> and there's a dude behind you. Like I know there's survivalist yeah, dudes and yeah. they just like living in the forest and they're like being survivalists that way. Mm-hmm. There's some people that do that. Yes, still sus as fuck. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Because you think about it. But like if you're lost and then another dude just finds you, he followed you. Mm-hmm. Maybe or maybe he's just. I still like even if maybe he was just on the same route. Maybe no. Maybe he just <laughs> same lived, lost route. Maybe he's Tarzaning it and just wants to do survivalist shit. But even then, Stop. I still wouldn't trust him. Okay, yeah, that's the point. Even if he wasn't following me or anything, it still feels sus. Because yeah. people that do that end up being a lot of the time alone. And as you know, there's a lot of side effects when you're in solitary or by yourself a lot. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of mental side effects. But the it. bear wins. But the bear wins. The bear wins. <laughs> Either way, we all agreed. Bear. <laughs> okay. Are we ready to move on? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That was that was a okay. good question. Yeah. Before we move on to our audio listeners, head over to our YouTube, which will be down in the link or in the description. We'll finally post. Yes. Well, we have a cool new setup, I would say. And so. we are coming up with more, maybe more posting on more videos other than podcasts as well, I hope. Yes. I'm, I'm cooking stuff. You're? 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 All right, let's see if this oh, works. Sh- we, we forgot to add that sound. What we- sound? Your? Your. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can make it. <laughs> All right, moving on to our topics. Wolverine and Deadpool. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no. Ah, <laughs> uh, dude, why? I need to fix that. It, it, re- it doesn't. It, yeah, I needed to restart when it. Either way, it's good. <laughs> yeah. All right. Our, our our little animation things are working right. So yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Okay, now, all right, I I could have sworn this is the what the new Deadpool trailer that we just got. It's the first one. I could have sworn the first one was a full first trailer. No, the but first it was one was no, at the it Super was Bowl. Teaser. It was yeah, it was teased. just a teaser, but it was like a minute and a half, and it gave us more than this one did. Yeah, this I one mean, just kind of showed feel us like, more action scenes. Yeah, this one showed us more Wolverine, but I feel like it still doesn't give us anything towards the story well, no really. it, it kind of gave us who's gonna be in it well true true, true. but like it, it, i still don't know the, wh- i still don't know what's gonna pool. happen yeah we don't we dog saw, we saw dog the pool. guy That's the dog. from oh x-men first class yes oh the, what's okay. his name the red one the red yeah one. the the devil looking one. Oh, um, Azazel, Azazel, yeah, Azazel, Azazel, Nightcrawler's dad, Nightcrawler's dad, oh, and there okay. was like more, but I don't remember their names. Yeah, when they're when she's getting off the ship and they're all lined up. Oh, is that um the daughter of Nightcrawler? Oh no no no! <laughs> you said getting it's, off the ship. Getting off the ship, we believe to be Xavier Charles Xavier's sister, sister the one that can walk. Oh, okay, okay. Like you walk. Walk. Like you walk. I'm still not over that joke. Oh my god, that oh joke is so gosh. funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. The one that can that can walk. <laughs> Restart it again. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I'll fix that later. I'm sorry. Just let, oh we're gonna have to let these play out now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um But as from what we've seen on the trailer, it looks crazy. Yeah. Deadpool you know, gets stabbed in the penis. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. then mm-hmm. Wolverine gets shot in the kidneys like, multiple times, yeah. oh, and that God. fight scene overall just looked like nice. Wait, but I have a question. Mm-hmm. I mean, we don't know. Is this getting picked up from you know when Wolverine died in his movie, Logan? Logan. Okay, so that is they, it gonna be that one? Because he was a, powerless. No, no, like no, no, his no. powers are the, fading. This is this is this Wolverine is from a different universe. Okay, yes. it's not that one. Okay, it's a universe where this Wolverine let his world die. So Deadpool oh. is, I think Deadpool, he, he's going to lose his world, his family. So mm-hmm. he goes to find that Wolverine mm-hmm. to help him. Okay. Help me save my world. So that's what's happening. Okay. Th- that's okay. all we know. Yeah, because okay. it turns out, yeah, cause if I was anything, like, this canonized Deadpool 2 going back in time to fix the timeline, 
Mm-hmm. You know how he went back in time, saved his wife, and mm-hmm. all that. Mm-hmm. It canonized that because they're all there in the beginning. Yeah. So I made that canon, yeah. and now it's probably the time guys coming in and pulling them out, and then something happening with Wolverine. Yeah. But I'm just wondering, is this from the trilo- Wolver- uh, X Men trilogy where Jane Jane becomes a phoenix and he ends up killing her? Oh. Hmm. I don't think there's gonna be a lot of that stuff involved. It's really just Wolverine yeah. helping Deadpool. Well, there's a lot. But of I mean, of they already said what's his face is gonna be in it. Um. Doctor Xavier's gonna be in it. Xavier's gonna the be little in girl it? from Logan's gonna be in it. <gasps> <gasps> she is. Yeah, <laughs> I heard. Saying, I was wondering that. I heard. Yeah, she's gonna be in it. So that's why oh. I'm like, maybe all the universes and whatnot. But yeah. yeah. Okay, so at the end we see we see him jump through. We see them jump through a Doctor Strange portal thingy. The, the hop made me <laughs> laugh. Just the, the legs when they're like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you think they're going? To hell. No. I'm just no. <laughs> to our timeline? To our timeline. I'm just still also waiting for the time when Deadpool meets Spider Man. Like, if it's Ryan Reynolds and Tom ha- uh, Holland. Holland. Yeah. Holland if it, who, how is that going to work between the two of them? Because Tom Holland's Spider Man isn't as jokes. Like, he doesn't have as many jokes as other Spider Man, as far as I can tell. Um, I don't think he's as funny as other the Spider Man were. Unless he jumps into another timeline and we get another Spider Man. Yeah, mm. maybe. I don't know because this is no, a Mar- this, I know. Wait, no, this is part of Marvel now. Yes. Yeah. So this is not Sony. Mm-mm. No. So, and I'm still wondering: Are we gonna get a different Wolverine at the end of this? Because you know, I don't know. I don't think Hugh well, yeah, Jackman's other, coming back after yeah, this. Yeah, that other actor. Yeah. I think we will meet more Wolverine. Oh yeah, which obviously. will help well, us set up say, the actual. Um, <laughs> Henry Cavill is one of them. Yes. Yeah, and then the other actor. Yeah. But I'm just wondering. So, so we are going to see a few. How afterwards, who's going to continue to play the Wolverine? It won't be. It won't be Hugh Jackman. No, obviously not. He looks a lot younger. Th- like he looks very good. He looks great. Yeah. I know. Dude. Look at those arms. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Oh God. But you shouldn't have let him hit it raw. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I, I'm looking forward to this, and it's coming out on my birthday. Yeah, July yeah. 26. I'm hoping to get a. a, a <laughs> yay! <laughs> Bitch, you better be joking. <laughs> <laughs> they had to steal my fucking day. <laughs> Sorry. Wait. Yeah. Let them play out so they don't. Next time we press oh, them, they okay, don't. Okay. 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 Yeah. Um. I hope I can get an ex- uh, early showing with my job. Ooh, maybe. Ooh. maybe. It, I, I will Your boss would probably go for that, I feel like. I would have to drive far, though. Hey, worth it. Hey, <laughs> hey worth it. <laughs> uh, okay, well, let's see what happens. Do you Look, think he'll restart the entire thing? The entire MCU? Probably. I'd say so. But not like a full restart. I'm just not, it's not cleaning like a, it up. They can't re- yeah, clean it up. They can't really restart it. No. It's like just cleaning, cleaning it up. It. Too many contracts have <laughs> already it. been made. Yeah. All right, let's see what happens. Mm-hmm. All right, next thing, the Joker <gasps> trailer. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's no. I, I don't. I don't think so. It, it's it's going up there, dog. It's going up I there. I mean, so okay, the trailer is a, this trailer is another trailer that I was like, I don't know what's happening. After watching what's going it, to happen? I just needed to get like help. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the point. It, well, not that point, but that's the story. Have you not seen the first movie? No. You didn't see the first one? No. Nope. He hasn't seen the first <gasps> one. I know what happens, but I don't. I didn't the watch it. The first movie it's good. I liked it. Uh, every time crazy. I see I see Hen- Hakeem Phoenix just play that role, I'm just thinking, stop it. <laughs> Get some help. <laughs> Why? Because just look at okay, him. I know, yeah, but, but that's like, a character. I know, but that's still, just story. like, yo. That means yeah. he's good. If he oh no, hell yeah, he's great. <laughs> I, but like, he's gonna. The fact that he lost all that weight again oh my God. to oh, play him, and then just he Rocked gained it, it all back during the press. Uh, during the promotion of the first one, and then just lost it all again. They can't send him on, pr- on a press tour again. They can't. That can't be healthy. No, leave, leave the poor remember, man okay, alone. The, the the last one. Remember that weird interview with Jimmy Kimmel? That's why leave the man alone. Mm-hmm. He's not. Built but then for they press. no. It was send Lady Gaga Jimmy to Fallon. do it all. Yeah, you're right. She would do it better. Yeah. Not even that she would do it better. You can just tell that he doesn't like to do that. He's not. He's he's not for him. I know. He'll, but he'll it, just want to show it, up, promote it, it, the movie, and leave. It worked out. Oh no, yeah. I'm sure he's great. proud of this movie. Yeah, that's, not, like, that's pl- not the thing in question. The question is, he doesn't feel like having to go to interviews and shit with people. True, true. He's not that type of actor. 
Like he's not. He's it's like yeah. it's obvious that he's not friends with any of these hosts. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But what do we think about how the movie looks? Oh. I want to watch it. I want to watch it. My favorite shot is when they're both walking up. Like I think they're going to like a courthouse. Oh, the, oh yeah. 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 I think when yeah where, where Lady Gaga is in that scene like the way yeah, they're just yeah, walking yeah. up and then they do this kick thing they start dancing mm. that looks crazy they really they picked a really good person to play that how Joaquin Phoenix is Harley Quinn because you think about it who else could really do it other than Lady Gaga that has that crazy look the only person I can think of is the actress with that did Anya the, Taylor no not really Anya Taylor not Anya mm-hmm. <laughs> no uh, have you ever seen Sweeney Todd <gasps> oh, what's her, her name? Yeah, her. Um, the one that was the red, uh, the red queen in Alice in Wonderland. The lady from Harry Potter. The lady from Harry Potter. Oh, what is her name? name? I got it. I got her name's it. Maggie. Put the put the song. No. Oh. <laughs> what's her name? Maggie. It's not Maggie. Maggie. It is something Carter. You can stop it. Oh. Helena. <laughs> Helena. Yeah. Bonham Carter. Carter. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. But her. Oh my God! She but would, she would, she's kind of old. She could have also done it, but that doesn't I think, matter. She could have. Oh my God! But I still, I still like Lady Gaga for it. Yeah, like it's between. I would say those two. Okay, now how do you think they're gonna incorporate the musical uh, side of it? Because the first one wasn't a musical. Mm-mm. So Maybe. how would how would this work? Uh, the last musical I saw was the Mean Girls one, <laughs> which yeah. is not that was which, not the right way to do maybe, that. Maybe, maybe yeah. like a situation will be happening, and then they'll go I, into a I, fantasy yeah. moment I in their the, minds. Like there's a scene where oh, they're okay. dancing. Yeah, yeah. So mm-hmm. I think it'll be like that. They're imagining it, but it's not actually. But happening. in like reality, they're like probably killing someone or something bad's happening. But in their mind, they're both just in oh, their fantasy love. That's gonna yeah. look crazy. Because that's what <gasps> kind of happened in the first movie. Some oh, scenes be good. weren't real somewhere. That's going to be good. Now, do you think they'll... They're showing them in, like being in love yes. in the trailer. Mm-hmm. But we know Harley and Joker are toxic. Joker does it to have a minion. But I don't know about this one because this one doesn't have... This one's different. This one yeah. might actually fall in love with Harley. Yeah. Because you could say like Jared Leto's Joker obviously just wanted to use Harley. <laughs> the one from the yeah. animated show. They're like all other Jokers yeah, have always Jokers, used yeah. Harley. This one doesn't have a reason to use her really yeah they're both just kind of crazy they're both going through it yeah. yeah but it's also crazy how she's oh, i don't know if she is or not she's no, not like, a psychotherapist well, or they, she's not a therapist what if, if she was a therapist before she's just like going into her treatment because she went crazy before she met joker that could be possible but i don't know <laughs> <laughs> what about like hmm. each of them betraying each other no because <laughs> it has to go wrong this relationship it won't doesn't last. have to they it can both be ha- chaotic together they can change, if, yeah but if they want to be true to the story well what, what's not the like, story not, here not like true to the what eventually happens to these two characters what's supposed to happen there this could be it's i'm being honest this could be this is its own unique story it has no batman so the joker has is just a chaotic figure trying to change society in a way but you know they're not gonna agree on something. Oh yeah, probably I the mean, methods. Yeah. The methods. <laughs> He'll be wanting to do a whole psychological joke, and she'll just want to get it done. Yeah. It, it, you know what? It brings my mind a comic that came out called um, "Batman: The White Knight," where Joker. Oh, <gasps> I love that. I have that comic. Yeah, temporarily becomes sane. Yeah. And it was all because Harley made a drug that made him sane for a bit. Whoa! And it and it ends with yeah. them having twins and like it's crazy. Whoa! And it turns out that there was a new Harley head that are replaced Harley and like. Yeah, I feel like we're gonna see um more mature versions of these characters, or not. They're just gonna be bad <laughs> shit crazy. Yeah, I know. Yeah, that. exactly. But like bad shit crazy with the mature, not mature, but like a different spin on them. You Very know what I would so. love to see in this movie? So you know how Lady Gaga has that song "Bad Romance." Yeah. Oh. I need that in like <laughs> classical, like piano version. Ooh, that would be good. That would be oh, so good. That would be good. Caught in a bad room. Uh, nope, copyright. <laughs> yo, yo, wait. Yo. When, when would this come out? Do we know? October fourth. Ooh, it's a Halloween movie. Ooh. <gasps> oh wait, Perfect dude, this is gonna way. happen again where her and Joker are the new Halloween costumes. Ah. Worth it, but like if it's their, this one, their yeah. Sti- their Honestly, styles. yeah, I'd wear that suit. That we won't, lady we won't get the. We won't get the the Margot Robbie Harley anymore. Well, no, she'll still be around. No, yeah, I know, but, but like, that's, it's the sadly, she's been categorized as slutty Harley. It's an end to an era. Damn. 
Good, not not because I she's mean, a slut as a character, but just the the clothes. It always works yeah. out for slutty people that want to wear slutty clothes. <laughs> Sorry, not to categorize that as slutty clothes. Just you know, yeah, it's clothes that show a lot. And stop it. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. I have a question. Yeah, I have a question. So you guys may or may not know. I don't know. Um. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> so at first I thought it Joker. This Joker with Joaquin Phoenix. It's mm-hmm. not Robert Pattinson's Joker, right? We want no. it to be we, Robert, right? Because then I heard it wasn't. It can't be. It was heard in an interview that they're in no way connected. Oh, it, it can't, can't be, be because uh, why? Because Joker met the re- Bruce Wayne, met Bruce as, a Wayne kid. as a kid in the first movie. Oh yeah. So it can't be him. Yeah, oh, that kid oh. he sees is behind the it's gate. It's the same way yeah, as yeah, Gotham. Yeah, I I Gotham's that. Joker was technically a yeah, different like, Joker. I know they're in no way connected, but I was like, why can't it be his Joker? But I forgot yeah, about yeah, that. Yeah, which sucks though. Like this Joker ah, with that Batman would have been, so been amazing. Yeah, but he already has Barry. Yeah, we're getting Barry as the Barry? Joker. Ba- the guy from oh, Saltburn. Yeah. Did you ever watch Saltburn? We explained it to her. Yeah, you watched it. You watched oh no, it? I did. no, you made me watch it. Remember, you put clips. Yeah, put clips. I was not gonna watch that fully. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you should. <laughs> you're just in the middle. You're just watching it, and then. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Okay, but yeah. All right. Let's hope this movie is good. I'm watching it. Um. No, I just have like one more thing. I had one more thing, and it's leaving me, and it's gone. It's oh, just gone. Then it's gone. It's it's gone. It's go on, move on. The way your character looks while you're saying that. Ah, I remember. I used to suck dick. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Jeez. All right, not this next one. No one's happy about Velma two. <sighs> For real, it came out of fucking nowhere. I didn't even see a post or nothing. I mean, I knew we were getting a season two when they announced it, but I had no idea when. And then yeah. it, they just dropped the trailer. I didn't see an announcement. I went on it on HBO Max trying to watch like, like a Paw Patrol movie, and yep. all of a sudden I'm like, Paw Patrol, <laughs> Velma season two. How is Paw Patrol better than Velma? I'm saying it made sense. I am saying <laughs> <laughs> structure. They, they didn't get rid of the pets. The one it thing that the story is based around. It has lessons. <laughs> They didn't get rid of the dog. <laughs> Gee. Anyway. Okay. Anyway. The question is, do you, want, do you want me to watch it? So do you want me to suffer so I can explain it to you guys? No, don't, don't bother. Do that. Don't, don't get, do that. No, because this, really? no, do hap- this is what we need mm-hmm. to happen. It's been low key. No one's heard about People it. People got to stop watching it. Yeah. Don't watch it. Let it die. <sighs> and if you watch it, you're. Hey, bitch, you better be joking. <laughs> no, it's not that one. You dumb Fucking bitch! I'm gonna no. fuck you. <laughs> that uh, yeah. yeah. If you watch yeah. it at that point, I'm gonna keep saying that to you. Cause I think just read about it. <laughs> just Look, read about it. Let it be canceled and then watch it. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. Let it be canceled yeah. and then we See, can but, watch. Um, I don't mean canceled socially. I mean I canceled feel, by the by the studio. I've been studying animation, mm-hmm. so th- I feel for the animation team. Oh no, yeah. Because of how much hard work they put into it, but I th- I I secretly think. That these animators are proud of what they make, which is really hard to uh, defend them. Yeah. Because uh, after the first season, the whole team put up a picture and then all the animators were posting like how this was like the best uh, moment of their lives and all that. And like, or uh, what's this, that thing they say? Like the, the, the best journey yeah. I've had yeah. or something, stuff like that. Like good, uh, happy posts about it. Mm-hmm. And I'm like. This is good for them. Like great like, job. I, on, I don't want to attack I, I, someone's work. You, you did know? a great. Yeah. You did a. You painted an amazing picture. I just hate what it represents. They did their <laughs> job. <laughs> they, they did, did their job. What if there are so many? This is clearly uh, has a, a um, what's it called um, a demographic that they're trying to go for, right? Yeah, astrology people. <laughs> no, it's like there's LGBTQ. I don't think it's that. I don't think they're going. Well, no, they might be aiming for that a little bit. They made Velma and and Daphne a Daphne thing. thing, but they also made Shaggy or Nardwall and and Velma a thing, and Freddie and Velma a thing, and yeah. certain parents and Velma a thing. What? This is a yeah. ha- this is it's- a this is a harem. It's oh a reverse God. harem. It's an anime. See, I think it's fucking see, anime. You, you could have done that with your own show. You didn't have to bring in the Scooby cast. You could have they, made a whole new other show. This is giving late night what you put at a hospital ER. Oh my god! Like, hey, everyone's trying to watch. This everyone's Am I wrong. It's where things go to die. The oh, ER. Dude, <laughs> you just put it in the ER waiting room. I love it. Oh my! You guys are having too much fun with the sound effects. Damn right. Look. 
I say it was low key. No one's bringing it up. No one's posting about it. Let it die. And then we can move on. But it, I kind of want to see how bad it is. It's only brought up the top well, no, shit. It's not even bad. The story won't make any fucking sense. Oh, I know that. But I just want to see how bad they go. Yeah. Like the first Don't do season. That to yourself. The Don't first. Do that no, to listen. Yourself. The first season, Daphne was a drug dealer for an episode. Yep, I remember that. Da- um, you explained that. Yeah, like Fred I, was a man child the whole season. Seems like yeah. or, or you know cosa? or gay fantasy to the max. Nardwall was in love with Velma the whole time, but then gets another girl, but then doesn't want the other girl. Yeah, and then like and Vel- and just Freddie's parents were evil. Yeah. And, and then Velma's well. mother. And then the, was in the first episode, this girl gets her head cut off and they put her brain in a jar and then she could yeah. speak. They figure out how to make her speak from the jar. The jars are coming back from what we've seen from the trailer. God. Yeah. It's, it's. No, a, but here, as I was looking for the to pictures for this thing, I saw a drawing of Scooby. Hold on. Yeah, but I don't think it's. No, no, no. But it, the, the title said it was it was didn't look like Scooby. It was like a drawing of a rabid dog but then the but the title said velma season two take on scooby oh so no. it's like i kind of want to see he's the real villain no i think they're just gonna add him but i just want to see how they would even interpret scooby in this universe in this velma world that's that's true I don't you know what i'll give it a i'll give it i'll give it a watch and then i'll come back with my things next week huh i i looked up if if is scooby and velma season two Okay. Scooby will not be featured in the show as it features the early days of the crew as they solve murders, mysteries, and find themselves getting Ooh. in over their heads more often than not. Oh, so then maybe what I saw was wrong. I think but that you found like maybe f- fan art mm, or like clickbait yeah. title, maybe theories. Maybe, maybe. But I just eh, it bothers me because <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh man. Que cosa? It's just one of those things. That it's so bad you have to watch it. Like, the mysteries are always solved by Velma, yes. But it's because Scooby and Shaggy would find the bad guy and chase and like have him chase them around while she found all the clues and then discovered it. Like, she would solve it all. Mm-hmm. But it would always be because Scooby and Shaggy like trapped the guy with Fred's idea. And then Daphne was, I'm, a so- I'm sorry, she was there for the looks. Jesus. <laughs> Until now. And now she's a drug dealer fucking... <laughs> I don't know. They wanted to give her. Um, Why does it gotta be Scooby characters? Why can't we just fucking make new characters? Yeah, I'm saying they can. It's, make- it's the whole circle thing. Yeah. Well, I'll I'll decide if I watch it. Yeah, you 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 have fun with that. I'm <laughs> still boycotting. Okay. On principle. Well, then let's go on to something that makes us happy. Let's go. <laughs> 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 the mini- I'm sorry. The mister, the Ministry of Ungentlemanly Warfare movie. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I've never seen. <laughs> Yay! I've never heard intern scream like that. Okay, I'm sorry, <laughs> dude. If you scream like that, that means this is that good. <laughs> sorry, I just had what? to. Remember. I just had to remember. That was, my, that was me gagging on this movie because it was fucking amazing. I wanted it. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, I wanted to see okay. this movie, but I had no money to go to the I theater. I am a World War II slut. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, I want to watch it. And I didn't know if you wanted to watch Get it. Get some help. <laughs> yes! <laughs> <laughs> I had to convince okay. a man's here. And he's like, okay, let's go. Oh, okay. I don't regret it. <laughs> yeah. How could you not even want to see a Henry Cavill movie, though? I, it wasn't that not I wanted to see the what movie. It was. I was, it's just, I was just like, okay. Eh. I mean, you're not a theater guy, so I get I'm it. I'm not. But but I do not regret going. It okay. was good. It was good. Like, I don't know how Rotten Tomatoes give it, gave it a 7 out of no, 10. No, this shit's better. But the, it's at least Usually the movies that have better audience mm-hmm. rating are really good. This was such yeah. a good movie. Ah! It was. So it's based on a true story, right? Yes. 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 Somewhat. So yes. the Germans had the U boat, which was a submarine that no one could hit at mm-hmm. the time. Yeah. So they get Henry Cavill and his team to Winston. go. Winston. When- Churchill. Churchill. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know why you keep calling him Winston. Mm-hmm. Well, that's, that's his name. Winston <laughs> Churchill. Face. Holy <laughs> shit. Yeah. So, so he gets them, sets them as a team. And they're not, it's like an, a rogue operation. They're not with yeah, the government. So they're by themselves. If Absolutely. If they, they get, get caught, caught by, the by the British, they'll go to jail. Yep. If they get caught by the Germans, they'll die. T- get tortured. And go they'll to jail. Die. Oh, okay. So they're on their own. And they got to go to 
Africa. Uh, I don't know where in Africa. It's like right it's where like the, a port or it's something. Like a, it's a port in Africa, and they got to go destroy the supply ship that's going to resupply all the U boats. Okay. It like goes out and resupply them all. Mm-hmm. And on the journey there, they got to pick up a guy that got captured. This guy in the blue, sh- in the in the next to Henry Cavill, to the left of Henry Cavill. They got to yeah. pick him up because he got captured because he was at the port at first gathering information. Mm-hmm. They also got two contacts over there, one being a uh, uh, African man who kind of runs a club there at Mr. the port. Mr. Heron or something Mr. like that. Mr. Heron yeah. or something. And an actress slash singer slash spy slash... What? Bat- no, what? No, 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 sorry, because you were naming so many ja- yeah, yeah, that, that's qualities. She, yeah, that's what she is. Actor, actor. slash actress. No, sorry. Actress, actress slash singer spy. slash... Spy, spy good slash with a gun, really good shot. Yeah, wow. that's cool. Okay. Slash, yeah. Talk about um, a resume. I think, I think American too. She's American. Wow. But everyone else is but mostly the, British the or Irish. The funny and, part yeah. was is that she was Jewish. She was a Jew. That's how the guy says it. Yeah. But Damn. Then, yeah, you know, like World War Two. Because there was Germans in World War Two, uh-huh. and. At the port, there's this one guy. I don't know if he was a general. He was a just. He was just in charge of the Germans there. He was a general. Like, yeah, uh, yeah. And he would. He would. What he would do is he would uh, handcuff people and tie them up and then beat the you know beat them. Beat them. Yeah. Uh, mostly women, of course. Yeah. You see mm-hmm. an image of him having beaten an Africa African woman. <gasps> wow. Yeah. Yeah. And sh- her job is to distract him. Not not obviously the way you think like. Keep them distracted, mm-hmm. flirt, you know. Yeah. And Jesus, the way she did it. <laughs> what did she do? It was good. It was good. It wasn't like, oh, you're so big and strong. No, no. It was testing him. I think this was like the first oh. movie in a long time that the woman wasn't like, oh, like I'm a girl. This she didn't act dumb. Like she was badass. No, okay. And not in like a pushy kind of way. It was surprising because of the actress. Because she's not because she's bad or anything, but she's in so many other <laughs> things that are like like that. Like uh, very like like a girly woman. like woman oh, okay. type, and yeah. this was like, yo, what? She <laughs> okay. was. I was like, Good. Asa. So they finally, what? So they finally drew a, a drew. They finally wrote a a strong like the, a not, sh- not a strong woman, just a woman just that like got the smart, job done. Like a badass smart, yeah. yeah. Without okay. like an like intelligent woman. Ca- yeah. Like, if it wasn't Henry Cavill scenes, Henry Cavill scenes with them and the crew, it was her scenes that would carry yeah. it. Yeah. So they wow. were separate, but it was. Yeah, it was oh my god, it's so good. And it was, uh, and there's a moment when she's singing, and this is at, like towards the end where she's <laughs> distracting everyone. She's singing, and it's really good. And then she goes up close Who's to the general. She like sits on what? Who's the actress? Um, Aisa Gonzalez. Oh, that sounds familiar. Yeah. Yeah. She's been in a lot of movies. This one. Oh, I love yeah. her. Yeah. It's her. Yeah, so I wouldn't expect in, a right. Yeah. Okay. okay. So they were hosting this party, and she's singing it for one, she, like as an attraction, dancing right? Dancing and whatnot. She sits on the general's lap to, you know, to flirt with him. Yeah. And she's she's singing in German. Yeah, but yeah. then she I says know. she's singing, and then she says a word in Yiddish, which is German, but Jews say it in Yiddish. Because oh, they're Jewish. It's like accents. Yeah, yeah. Like there's a different accent between our Spanish and Mexico Spanish and Salvador Spanish and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's that stuff. And then he just, he, <laughs> he literally goes, oh, that, he, he talks to like, there's people next to him like mm-hmm. also surgery. He's like, that was Yiddish. It looks we like have we have ourselves a little Jew. And I was a like, a little <laughs> Jew. And I'm like, yo, he said that a certain he way. He said it a certain way. Oh, oh, so in the movie, so there's a certain scene when they're talking. They're sitting at the restaurant, and it's so good because it blocks out all the background noise. Oh, yeah. And it's just them. T- you can just hear them two talking. Wow. That was so And it's so like the, the tapping good. of a cigarette. The tapping so of I thought ears. it was me. I was like, even the audio in this movie is amazing to you guys. That scene was like, wow. But it, it was Yo. never her being submissive of anything. No. It was her challenging him. Yeah. And, and then she was like, she, they, were, they were at the restaurant dinner party. She's like, I admire the Jew. <laughs> like she yeah, says it like that. She wholeheartedly tells him she's like, I'm Jew. And she just, it's silent. And the audio is just dead silent, no background. And then he's like, hold on, what? And Whoa. then she laughs. Because it, it's Whoa. just playing a scene. Dude, that scene was wow. so good. But she tricked, it's like the way of like, yeah, I'm going to double down on this, on this dare to see how you react. But, you know, it's like. Her job was to seduce him. And when that scene ended, we were like, she got him. She got she him. She got him. Damn. And then there were this also folded. before the party where she was going to sing. Mm-hmm. And it, this was a costume party. 
she shows up in this Cleopatra outfit. I'm like, yo. <laughs> but then she's like, and he's just there in a the shirt and shit. And he's like, she's like, Cleopatra needs her Caesar. And, and he's like, and no, she, I can show like you what a real horrible, party is. This horrible fucking costume that's like from Walmart. Yeah, but. Yeah. And she gets him in, in the Caesar costume. And, and like, he was like, pro, he's like, I can show you our German. Because there was another party where Germans are at. Mm-hmm. And and he and she's like, you're going to get into that fucking costume. Like, she, she fucking tells <laughs> yeah. him. Yeah. Wow. And it was good. Okay, so but that was that was just her. Then you go to Henry dude, Cavill. Henry Cavill yeah. and those dudes. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Every five seconds that I would see these guys, I would look over and be like, nut. Like <laughs> it was, dude. Like, dude, this casting was so good. Dude, she was there for Henry Cavill. I was there for Alan Richardson. I was there mm-hmm. for no. I was there for Hero. Oh yeah, you were there for I, Hero, the guy in the no, cap to the right. No, this one. Oh no, yeah, the no. one in the pink. Is sure. I'm there for Henry's beard, dude. I was there for Hero <laughs> and for Henry. I was there for Alan, which is the guy in the back on the on the so sale. It's Henry Cavill, Alan Richson, Hero Finest, Tiffin, <laughs> Henry Golding, wait, and wait, Alex Did you say Petty you were Fair. nut? Yes. <laughs> we would just like, look at each other. Nut. nut. Mm. Oh my god. And it was like, and, and Henry Cavill's British. Alan Richardson is Sweden. Swedish. Swedish. Yeah, Swedish. Hero um, is Irish. Irish. Alex is English as well. English, but and Henry Chinese Golding distant. is also English. But like okay. these interactions, guy, Alan Richardson, him in the background. That man was chaotic. He was so that chaotic. man was chaotic energy. Just comes in. They, they're they're invading this base to race re- rescue a guy. Right? They're walking in. He just he goes just in with a arrows. bow, fucking like <laughs> sniper's what? aim to a tower, another tower. Just they're walking and in like was no a, chill. Right before they went there, he's like, "I'm a lover, not a fighter." He's like, "I don't do that anymore." Like he's and like, they, "I don't kill people." They like even that. do bro flirting. <gasps> Oh they do, they do the flirting that bros do between each other. Oh, and he, he's talking to like the guy you said. Um, I forget the one you he liked. was talking to Henry Golding, the Henry guy Golding. from Crazy Rich Asians, and he's like something. What do you say? Like you, you would love the way I lo- like. I'm yeah. a lo- like they flirt. Like I'm like yo, why am I turned on? So I mean, it is like a war movie, but yeah. so you're saying that all their interactions are hilarious. They're yeah. beautiful, really. So it's like a fun war movie. And, and the movie starts with them being inspected by a German captain, and the, all you see is Henry oh. Cavill and Alan uh, Richson. And, and they, they, uh, they pretend to be Swedish just traveling along the coast. And, yeah. and he's like, ah, shoot this man. <laughs> like Alan says, putting at Henry, shoot this man. Yeah. I'll give you 100 francs if you shoot him. And they him. both just start laughing. Yeah. And then they kill everyone. <laughs> they kill everyone. Because Alan Richardson's character is good with a bow and a knife and used to wrestle bears. <laughs> Damn. Okay, so don't tell me how it ends because I want to see this movie for myself. Mm-hmm. But yes. If Rotten Tomatoes gave it a seven out of ten, what would you guys give it? Oh my god, a nine. ten. I'm saying ugh, nine and a half. Nine ten. and a half. It's up there. Not because not anything's missing, just because you it's know. It's just a fun, it's good movie. It's just a great movie. It was such a a good yeah. bro movie. Honestly, yeah, ten out of ten. Oh, it was bro. so good. Ten not even a bro movie. It was just a good movie overall. And then at the end, after the like it, the credits start rolling, mm-hmm. since it's a true story, you hear uh, you afterwards what pictures. happened to everyone afterwards. Oh, I love when they do that. One of these guys was captured and died in the camp. It, yeah. Well, that's it, likely to happen. No, I don't. It, I think one. I don't remember which one it was, but one of them did get like one of them did. No, have... he got captured and tortured, but he never said anything. No, yeah, yeah, but he died. Okay, no, so he I saw he died. I mean, no, duh, he died, but later. I don't think. I think oh, he well, died on the well, camp. Well, I, I saw the I saw the Henry Cavill interview he did. I think it was on Jimmy Kimmel mm-hmm. about this movie, and he said that his character was based on, or I don't know if it was based. It was. Um, inspired to be James Bond. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So he's the inspiration fr- for James from Bond. From the actual Damn. man who did it, that's where they got the James Bond stories. Wow. Yep. See, and it, it yep. just hurts that Henry never got his chance to be James Bond when they when they <sighs> almost casted him. Yeah. See, but do you th- in the future they have to cast a new James? Yeah. But they're but saying they're, Henry's too old now. They they might. But like they might change him to another race. Oh yeah, I heard that too. Which yeah. is fine. I don't. I, yeah, I've it's never fine. But like, like, Henry has been the actor that has been the most disrespected from Hollywood. Honestly, yeah. Henry Cavill does not get enough like credit for the shit he does. Yeah, and all the roles he's missed just because they didn't choose him in the end. Yeah, like, it's just <sighs> ridiculous. This but when he does good, a role, though. when he does a oh. movie, fucking. Oh. Did you see how he said he trained his beard to look like that? Yeah. I'm like, this <laughs> man is amazing. The we whole need- movie, I was like. Like and I was doing grunts and I was like, yeah. I mean, him and the Irish character had the best like conversations. 
Hero! Mm, wait, hero, <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. I just love these dudes so much. I need intern to watch more movies that gets her yes! like <laughs> Just get him. Just get oh a male cast. No, it's like the whole... Even, okay, there have been whole male cast before, but not like this. Not like this. No, not like this. Yeah. Because the whole male cast sometimes is either too bro-ish, Or too they're woke, too, like... Yeah, yeah, Or, yeah. like... They, they, they're not men that understand shit. They're like yeah. they're either too feminine. These and not in a bad way. That's fine. But these are guys that like instead of being just men, they're like human men. These are all yeah, gentlemen. Yeah, like gentlemen. Actual gentlemen. Yeah. Especially Henry Cavill, if you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait. I heard did you guys see that he's a, he's a, he's he's, he's going to have a baby. Yeah. We're getting baby Superman. Oh Aww. my gosh. I'm so happy for him. Just overall this movie is great. So I do recommend it's it. It's so good. Okay, I'm going to watch I, I, I want I wanted actors. to watch it, but Alan is a chaotic demon, but in a good way. <laughs> Hero is just beautiful. The way that man steers that ship. Yeah, he's a, he's a ship man. Henry Golding, the way he just be blowing up ships. He, he's an <laughs> explosive <laughs> man. If he's not, oh, and as he describes Henry Cavill describes his man, and he says Hen, his, his name's Henry, right? The actor, but I forgot the name. No, in the, the actor. Movie. Yeah. yeah, the actor. The actor. He, as well. he was just like, if he's not blowing something up in five minutes, he's having an anxiety attack. <laughs> yeah. And oh then my god. Alex, the way that man, the character can plan. He'll oh, plan yeah. things like boom, and then there's a where they steal the boat, and yeah, you were like, oh, they're gonna steal it, and then the second later, we're I, stealing. I the saw boat. a clip, and just the way Henry talks. Oh, the way they all talk. Oh, yeah, the way like, they all talk. Just it's this like, group of men is fucking funny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> And they're like they're, they're infiltrating the ship, right? Mm -hmm. Alan's going in there, and Hero or no, who was that? It was Alex and the other guy. Yeah, um, basically two guys are going character. in one way, and they're fighting like one or two guys, and they're having trouble. Alex goes he into goes a in hole by himself. Into by himself oh. through the back with a bow and arrow. Bow and arrow and Bowie knife takes out almost the whole crew. Oh my gosh! And he, and he, and he, then he finds a machete. <laughs> no, finds the, an axe, axe, an axe, a fireman's axe, and yeah. just goes to town. And you don't see like the blood and gore of it. And then mm -hmm. you see a window, and he's like. <laughs> he's like, he's like waving. He's like super nice, but he's also terrifying as fuck. Oh he's like a gosh. big cuddly bear. And a when killer, <laughs> uh. and one of these guys is getting tortured, and he had bloody nipples because they had put like a oh. battery car to his nipples. Uh huh. And they're like, "What's up with that?" He's <laughs> like, "Can you take it off?" And, oh, and the whole time they were rescuing him, he still had the car battery on him, tasing him. He just didn't feel it. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh! Like, okay. Al <laughs> Alan comes in, kills a guy with a Bowie knife. Fucking body slams another dude, kills him with a Bowie knife, and like they'll be like, uh, like crying away, <laughs> trying to get away, stab, stab, stab. And then he's like, all cute and cuddly. Oh my god! And he's like, gosh. oh, sorry about that. It took me so long. <laughs> like, oh, he takes his heart out. Oh yeah, he full on takes the heart he's out. He's all like a, squishing it. Like and he's like, oh. I want to have a jar of a hundred Nazi German hearts. <laughs> Damn. He's just like squishing it like a stress ball. See, and he's still a gentleman. That's that's what they mean. Ungentlemanly by that. warfare. Like they're uh, all, yeah. they're all. They just don't. The reason, like, they get Henry Cowell character out of jail to do this, and he hires everyone else that was in jail because oh. they just they were they they went to war. They wanted to fight the Germans, but they didn't. Say, they weren't following orders. They weren't. They just weren't following orders. Yeah, but they yeah, were getting yeah. the job done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And when they, after you know, I won't tell you what happens at the end, but. Oh. And then you find out <laughs> like what happened in their real lives afterwards. You're just like, oh, Aww. yeah. All but right, it, I'm gonna watch this. Good. It was really it was good. Really good. I recommend okay. the shit out of this movie. Ah! Now, oh, uh, Mads wanted to talk about this one. Yeah. Anyone but you made me believe in rom coms again. Really? Yeah. I feel like this is the only rom com we've had in a while. Yes. Yeah. Oh wait, uh, because that they Jennifer died down. Yeah, that Jennifer Lawrence movie that came. That was out. Not that's not a rom com. Rom that's a comedy. That's a comedy. Okay grow up story. I know but it was like the first time I had seen her like in a the poster the yeah. poster just looked kind of rom-com but, but no mm, this is yeah. rom-com this is a full rom-com rom-com you believe in love again I do the only thing I saw of this movie was when she's in the I don't know if they're in a coffee shop yeah yeah the beginning yeah, yeah the beginning that's all I've seen yeah and I, right when I saw that I was like oh this is a, this is the, adorable the chemistry that, yeah oh my god now I understand all the rumors that they were dating in real life even mm -hmm. though Sydney Sweeney's engaged, I'm just like, okay, I get the rumors, the but the chemistry, chemistry is insane. good. The conversations are good. Oh, they're, we don't know who she's dating, right? She's yeah, engaged. she's engaged. Yeah. To I don't know his name, but she yeah. Oh, okay. But, the, but, but that's besides but, the but point. But it wasn't him. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. But I we understand the rumors. Oh, and okay. So in this movie, she has an ex who she almost got married to. Uh huh. I need you to show him a picture. 
And it's I'll show the guy from. You get his good. picture. I get Glenn Powell. He's been in a few things. We're it's not going to tell you much more. Just I need you to pick between them. The <laughs> what? The his name's Darren <clears throat> Barnett. Okay. Okay. I got, I, I got. I got Glenn. Okay. Glenn is the me, guy. Which picture she, do you have? Zoom into it. So Glenn is this guy. The, the main. Ki- the main guy. Oh, okay. I'll get you a picture from the movie. Okay. Between these two, who do you think's better? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Um, this is just looks wise. Looks wise doesn't matter. It's fine. It's your opinion. Go ahead. Looks wise, I'm gonna have to, wait. What are the names? Glenn Powell. Okay, Glenn Powell, the lead of this movie. And I don't know his name. Jonathan. Darren Barnett. No, in the movie. Oh, in the movie, his name's Jonathan. I'm gonna have to go with Jonathan. Ah, oh, fuck you. Yep. <laughs> your, Why your, were you guys disagreed? Your, yes. You better be. Well, joking. semi. <laughs> <laughs> Cause she was, she was like Jonathan's. She's like she wanted to go for Jonathan. I was like, no, Glenn. <laughs> no, <laughs> like Glenn. It, it's Jonathan. It's Glenn. Okay, wait. Just looks. It's Jonathan. Yeah. But personality, I don't know yet. Okay. The whole point is, <laughs> the movie's really good. <laughs> okay, okay. You haven't seen it, have you? No, I haven't. It's on Netflix. It's on Netflix. Take okay, 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 okay. Um, but it is really good. Overall, the chemistry's there. The funny moments are there. Mm-hmm. Like and they're in Australia and there's a there's a scene where Glenn Powell like she has her butt in his pants because they're pretending to be together. Her hand in his pants. Yeah, and his on her on his butt cheek. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah I remember. Yeah. I always seen that one too. She pulls it out and there's a spider on her hand. Oh yeah, and it's yeah. a big spider and he's like, oh my fucking god, and he gets naked. <laughs> butt naked. <laughs> and he throws his short and they're on hiking. He throws his shorts and his shirt over uh, yeah. across the mountain. He's like, look, look, check me, check me, like check his <laughs> asshole and everything. And he's like, they look for a place to hide. Just check. <laughs> They, they hunt in pairs. I read the spider they hunt in pairs. pairs. No, they don't. I don't know if well, that's yeah, true Yeah, but not. that's what he said in the movie. And he's just there butt-ass naked. Damn. So. Overall, great movie and made me really believe, like rom-coms again. And it wasn't like a too woke or too. Yeah, because it was just too the last bro-y. rom-com I remember is like a Sandra Bullock movie or something. I yeah. I don't remember the last rom-com. But this one was good. Yeah. It was good. The chemistry, the jokes. Oh, the roast. Of course, it would be Sydney Sweeney to the bring back rom coms. The fucking right? Roast. Yeah, it like was. She, it was she has movie. that look. It was a good movie. Yeah. And then what, what was? You know how most times sex scenes would just be like them, like wrestling on a bed. Mm-hmm. This one had them doing that, but it also had then suddenly both of them just laying there laughing. I'm like, oh my god! It goes from the Aww. kitchen, the kitchen to the shower to the shower to the bed. But then the in between those moments, they're like cuddling and just laughing. And I'm like, oh. Aww. <laughs> In do between they, those moments. Do like, they end oh. up together? Watch the movie. Watch it. Wow. Okay. They do. They do. They, they do. do. <laughs> of course. It's a rom-com. They have oh, to. Yeah. I almost pressed the wrong button. Yep. But it was, All right. It was uh, good. Wait. To our listeners, there haven't been the sound pads for a while, but they're back now. I apologize for that. <laughs> you dumb <laughs> fucking <laughs> bitch. I'm going to fuck you. I deserve that one. Yeah. <laughs> yep. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Just, that, that, that's, we're going to start that one off with that first one. Mm, yeah. Your, All right. Now, moving on to, oh, wait, hold on. How did I do this again? You tell me, dog. Hold on, hold on. It looks ugly. There you go. Mm-hmm. Moving on to video games. Which Starting off, nothing about. Dragon's Dogma <laughs> 2. Okay, this is all a mad here. Your mom's dog? What? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I'm sorry. I love it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> right off the bat, your mom's dog. Who? <laughs> and that's all I have to say for video Dragon's games, guys. Dogma I am too. muting myself. <laughs> no, you, can, you no, just keep, you're the you're his heckler. You dumb fucking <laughs> bitch! I'm gonna no. fuck you. Oh my god! You try to heckle me? I dare you! No, I'm just kidding. Dragon's okay. Dogma two. Okay. What Literally the isekai game I've been asking for. Now it's oh. not you. You don't reincarnate into another world. Nothing like that. It just feels like that. Okay. <laughs> and it's basically you're a. You used to be a king, but you lost your memories, and now you're a slave in a mine. Kind of whack. That's kind of whack. Yeah. <laughs> but the whole thing is, I, let me, I'm gonna be honest. I didn't pay much attention to the story. I was just going around killing things. <laughs> Okay. You really are going to be my heckler for this, aren't no, you? No, no, no. It's good. It's good. I'm sorry. I think we should fire an intern. I don't we, even get paid. We, if even we better. don't even get paid, You dude. don't get a severance package either. This is what I'm here for. Anyways, continue you with your dog's mom. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's you're, you're saying mean, the funny thing is you can be an animal person in this game. <laughs> There's well, furries. Continue, continue. 
there's furries in this thing, all right? Wait, so you're saying it's 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 a good game, like it's, it, what it's a good game. It it's is what you've game. always wanted. Not what I've always wanted. It was oh. a nice surprise. Oh, okay, like okay. it's all right. It's all right. It's just it's, it's big. It's big. <laughs> okay. I don't mean map wise. I mean I literally finished the whole game and I hadn't explored all the map. So like it's oh. not big, big. Mm-hmm. It's just there's a lot of things. It there's looks a lot of tiny things. There's a lot of tiny things. It's very aesthetically pleasing. There's a lot of dungeons. There's an elf village. It's it's a lot. Mm-hmm. Now, I wouldn't say it's worth the sixty dollars. Oh, what? it's a good game. Don't get me wrong. I finished it. The class system's good. The combat's I. Right. The partner system's kind of if the. It's a good game. It's just it it. It distinguishes itself differently more in classes and character creation. And instead of sto- like the story is you got killed by a dragon, which then causes you to be revived with mm-hmm. a scar on your chest. And you're called an arisen and you lead pawns, which are just people from other universes that come in through a rift. Yeah. And you make your own pawn, your main pawn, and you can use other people's main pawn and stuff like that. Go ahead. Does arisen have riz? He does not have Riz. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. It was there. You can make him have Riz by having him have a romance with some other people, but as far as I know, he does not have Riz. Apologies. His Riz, his Riz is giving people mm. gifts. It's giving. But yeah, you 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 end up mm-hmm. back in your kingdom, but you find out that there's a fake Arisen and a fake leader. Right? Mm-hmm. Has nothing to do with the story. No, oh, okay. <laughs> it's like you get back there, and I did the quests for it, and it's just like, okay, yeah, you you gathered up all the info. Good job. No, who would so you... So it's like a distraction from the actual game? No, it's part of the main story. Okay. So it has its problems, you're saying? I feel like it's the problem of you completed that quest, nothing changes. Oh. You still got to go. Yeah, it's like, you're still yeah. not king again. No one recognizes you a king till after you fi- was, defeat the final boss. So it was like a filler in a, in a video it's a game? Whole bu- it feels like a whole bunch of side missions in the game leading up to the boss battle. That you still have to do or you, you can't You don't have on? to do them, but oh, it's okay. encouraged that you do them. Like, the main okay. thing you'd go into this game for is to explore and to level up in your skill. Yeah, okay. And I fin- I ended up completing, like, four or five classes. Mm-hmm. And the classes are pretty good. I even missed out on some because I didn't discover them. Oh, you love class games. That's why you liked, like, this game. Yeah, I started out as a fighter with a sword and shield, went to warrior with just a giant sword, went mm-hmm. to archer, then ended up at spear, ma- spear magic, sir, something like that. It's spear magic. And that one was my favorite because it was fun as fuck. And it was the best one to use to fight dragons, which is your main enemy, dragons. So who would you recommend this game for? Our cousin. And I recommend this no. game more for people who like <laughs> no, like, who who, like which, Monster Hunter, yeah, who just like, like to grind fights. Oh, okay. Like, people, that's what I meant. Like, like, what? like people that like to jump into a dungeon and just kill everything. Okay. Like, it's a fun game. I would not go into it for the story. There is oh. some interesting side stories, but yeah. most of them don't have a big enough change to affect anything. Okay. Mm, and I'd say go into it to fight cool looking monsters and have cool fights. So for example, if you liked um If you like Eld- Monster Hunter. Elden Ring? Elden uh It's not that the same thing. There is big monsters to fight, but they're not oh, never they're mind. not difficult. Oh, okay. Yeah. You yeah. can mostly spam the same attacks and you're good. Is it like like the playing style, the yeah. mechanics? Is it open like open world? So is, but is it like open world like Elden Ring or like uh Baldur's Gate? Elden Ring. Okay, see, I like that more. It, it's fun game to play. The The combat will keep you there. The okay. story won't keep you there. Not because the story is bad. It's just it feels very much background. It doesn't have a big enough effect where it's like changing the world. But you would also say wait till it's like 30 bucks? Yeah, I just I, I, I wouldn't pay the, the $70. Or no, 80 now. Cause Damn. Games, yeah, games went up 10 bucks. remember? You paid them though, right? <laughs> <laughs> he had to review it. I had a discount. Okay. I don't know. Wait, no. Yeah, I did pay for it. Look, it's a good game, <laughs> but it's it's more of a fighting game. I'd recommend. I'd say. Okay. Hmm. What would you rate? What would uh, to end rate? It out the rating? How would you would rate you? your dragon's dog's mom? <laughs> seven dogs out of eight. Seven, seven dogs out of seven, eight. Seven out, of, seven out of seven out of ten. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Unlimited that's good. massages. <laughs> I can't say the word massage when I have the word unlimited in front of it. And she's been making, <laughs> she keeps laughing. That is that. so random. You're just say, like, say you unlimited, like, unlimited massages, unlimited massages, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. unlimited massages. Oh, that's 
sausages. Your dyslexia is betraying you. I don't know. I don't think that's my dyslexia. dyslexia. That's my mouth. It's my <laughs> mouth betraying me. All right, but overall, seven out of ten. I do recommend it if you like like games where you have cool fights and cool fighting scenes because yeah. you can cool start, There's the skills with the classes that you can do cool things with. Okay. Now it's more of a game where you go in and explore the whole world and don't bother with the main mission. <laughs> okay. I like this new <laughs> quick a review you did of Thank a you. video game. Yeah. You should do well, that I finished more. this game this week, that's why. And I was like, okay, yeah. after doing all that, what was the story? Fuck it, I know. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, what was yeah. the point? They, there was this thing with the fake arisen and a queen that I was like dealing with, but I never overtook the queen. I never got rid of her. Like at the end of the game, I killed the final boss and I was yeah. like, You're the king. And then <laughs> there was this weird shadowy dude following me. He's like, You wanna change the fate of the world? And I'm like, okay, I followed him again. Like, you have to do it multiple times, and then you're mm -hmm. back in the boss fight. I'm like, so our crackhead was offering you drugs throughout no, the game? No, no, no. He was a ghost man. That's what it seems. He was a ghost man. But I was like, you want to change the fate of the world? And then <laughs> suddenly I'm like, pressure. okay, I think there's another final secret final boss back into the main boss with the same dragon. I'm like, the fuck? Do I have to restart? Did I not do something right? <laughs> yeah. It was, a, it was that. But you liked it. Choices do have an impact, but. Eh. Yeah. All right. Dog's mom. Dog's mom. Seven out of ten. Out of Dragon's ten. dog's mom. Wait for dog, the discounted dogs. Dogma. Okay. Oh, this is the second one, though. Yeah. Dragon, Dragon's oh, so Dogma 2. Okay. It continued? When mm -hmm. did it come out? Two months ago, maybe. Okay. I don't, I don't remember. Yeah, we've been gone a while. We've been gone a while. Okay, now. Oh, shit. Fuck. Look at what you did. Sorry. You broke it. Now, moving on to Rivals. Marvel's Rivals, which is going to take over Overwatch. All we got was a trailer. That looked like a, a Overwatch demo. Literally looked like Overwatch. It looked like okay. someone made a fan version or like modded Overwatch into Marvel's Rivals. Okay, but it looks good. Are you going to play it? Ah, uh, yeah. Ooh, good luck with that multiplayer shooter aspect. Oh, wait, you know, I suck at that. And sp I wonder how they're going to do with the abilities. Wait, if you're so you're not playing? I'm thinking about it. If you're not playing, I'm just going to get... Depends how much it costs. I think it's... Oh, it's Marvel. Wouldn't it be free? <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> no. I know that, and I don't play games. But it's like a multiplayer. If it's free, like... it's going to be full of microtransactions. If it's not free, it's going to be 30 bucks because there's no story. Well, clearly it should be free because they clearly didn't. They just copy-pasted Overwatch. Yeah. They don't. They didn't develop anything. <laughs> I don't even know if they hired the Bethesda, the guys that made Overwatch. Wait, no, Bethesda didn't make Overwatch. No, that it was Blizzard. No, Blizzard, sorry. I wonder if they just hired Blizzard and told them to make Overwatch, but with Marvel. And yeah. I'm also wondering how they're going to do abilities. Like, Iron Man's obviously going to have his repulsors, but Hulk is just going to run at you and punch you? He's going to have no long-range attacks? I'm guessing. I'm guessing this is their way of... Okay, but you know me. I. It's like... It's more of the characters that are bringing me in, not the gameplay. You know, you remember Marvel's Avengers? Yeah. I wonder how Spider Man's gonna swing in this game. This. Oh God! Because the swinging was bad in that game, <laughs> and this is kind of the same similar situation. Yeah. So see, I want to see how it goes. They just like, give Spider Man Genji's movement. <laughs> oh my! Ew! No. Any that questions? Won't work. She doesn't know anything. Just, She's yeah. waiting for the next slide. <laughs> Probably. Okay, but I, I just want to. This could go bad. Why is Fallout in video games? Because it's like. A video game, the show, show. based. Like I know, but to show based on a video game. I like how we pass by Marvels and we're just looking at what's <laughs> next. <laughs> like okay, we'll see how it goes, but I don't know. You could give a shit. <laughs> no, it'll either be, it comes out, it's popular because of the characters yeah. for like a good month, and then it dies out. Yeah. Or they just completely d the characters are bad from the beginning. And the game's glitchy as hell from the beginning, and it's full of microtransactions, and you got to pay for everything you look at. Or if it's if it's not free, then you have to pay. I think it's a, just a cash grab. I'm a I'm gonna see how it goes. I have to pay if I have to pay more after buying the game. It's a cash grab. <laughs> All right, next <laughs> Fallout show. Fallout the show and <laughs> intern knows about intern? this. Intern, intern, well, you're the only one that watched it, right? I yeah. played Fallout too. Oh, yeah, which one did you play? Vegas. The, the best one. The oh wait, best the, one. The, the best mobile one? one. No, Vegas. Vegas. Fallout New Vegas is New a Vegas video is game. Is a video game. There uh, is the also mobile. mobile. Game, Mobile's also good mobile. Too. I tried it. You I said I you only played the mobile one. No, no. The full. The Okay, so intern, what do you? What, is it a good show give worth a watching? Give me a okay. <laughs> yes, it's a great <laughs> show. Watch it. It ends on a cliffhanger. That's oh. a bad. Season two has been confirmed. Season two has been confirmed. 
but it's really good. Um, really? It's really cute how it starts. Um, she's a really good actress. Like, now is she? She did it good. Is she that headstrong woman of like I gotta be independent? Yeah. How did they write the girl? So sorry that we I always mean, jump to this. It just it matters. I liked yeah. it, but no, there's no but. She's very dumb, and I'm not saying yes. like yeah, she's not a dumb female. She's lived <laughs> underground. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So like she's you, very. <laughs> <laughs> Now we, dude, I can't believe I fucked up the sound pads from the beginning. We <laughs> missed so many good ones. Yeah. Yeah. She's very naive because she doesn't okay. know what life is upstairs. Yeah. Okay. Wait, what vault was she in? Third. 300. 33. 33. 32. I don't remember what that 32 vault. or 33. Oh. Okay. It was obviously. 31, 32. Is, she's in 32. Was she the only one in the vault? No, there's other people. But like, she's the only one that goes out or. Let me explain. <laughs> I'm just saying because usually both. So it starts out and she's talking. Yes. And she's like, "Oh, my name is her name's Lucy." Okay, I don't know. I haven't watched the Lucy. Show. Her name? No, no, no. Actually, it does not start out that way. It starts out in the year 2077, where the atomic bomb was the dropped. first one. It dropped, and it's a dad and the little girl, and they're at a birthday party, and then poof, the city blows up, okay. and the dad gets the daughter on the horse, and then they go, and then it pans to Lucy years later. In, she was in the, the girl. Vault. No. Okay. Just to watch We don't know who that is yet. But that's besides the point. And it just starts out with her talking about herself and she's like, Um, my reproductive um system is very intact. So she's <laughs> she's requesting for someone from another vault to come in and mate with her and get married and have kids. Oh because okay. everyone in that one vault eventually you get related. Like to your dad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so that's crazy. Yeah. So they approve her request and she gets ready for her wedding day. And they go to Vault 33 sends a guy. And it's just like, who am I marrying? And the guy comes out and they have the wedding. And then um, they go to the room. Like, I guess they have family, like little family mm -hmm. vaults. And that's her vault with the man's. And he just gets naked. And she has this thing she says. She's like, okie dokie. That's, what she, that's her thing. That's her little catchphrase. Aww. So they do their thing. And then all of a sudden, she's, he starts trying to kill her. Oh. Oh. And then, um, no, no, no. She sees something. I don't remember. Turns out he's a, what are they called? Serial killers? No. <laughs> Psychopaths? Oh, she, he's a raider. He's a raider. Oh. He's a raider. So she kills him. Well, uh -huh. she like beats him and whatever. And she goes outside and then all her vault people are getting killed. <gasps> by the She let a raider By the tap. raiders. <gasps> <laughs> she ra Dude. <laughs> Oh my god. He was hot. He was oh, hot. Oh, he was hot. He was hot. Oh, thankfully. And then she did think he was from Vault 33. So so yeah. everyone from Vault 33 is attacking people from Vault 32 and they're killing everyone. Because they became raiders. Technically, Vault 33 so, wait, wasn't are, Vault Vaultees. They were raiders. Oh. Wait, so what are raiders in this world? Like they're, what the name they're suggests. They're people who go they into vaults raided. and they raid the they vaults. Raid, they're like Vikings. They come over, they raid, wow. and they take all the supplies. Okay. It's in Dang. the name. Uh, I don't know this world. Hey, bitch, you better be joking. <laughs> <laughs> the so they raid, and then eventually we find out that those people weren't the vaulters. They were they were raiders. And all the wow. vaulters had died. And the vaulters had died. But when the first show first starts, it's like, oh, look, all these dead bodies. So they automatically think the raiders killed them, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So whatever that happens. And at the end of this, they take Lucy's dad, and he's the overseer. He's in charge of the vault. Yep. Oh. So they take him and they blow up like one of the tunnels or something to 33. And then she's like, I'm going to go find him. And that's how she gets out. Oh, well, it's yeah. the same as the fallout stories. Yeah. It's, Almost it's, every it's, fallout it's, is like, oh, they took your wife. Go find her. They took your kid. Go find yeah. her. Yeah. Okay. So that's cool. she gets out and she has like this whole mission. She meets um, the guy in the suit. The I guy forgot in the hat. his name. I forgot his name. Max Maximus. <laughs> that suit and then the funny. ghoul. The ghoul. That's the iron. I forget the, the suit, what the suit's called, but it's a power suit. Yeah. It's overpowered in the game. So she meets okay. Maximus. Like, it, there's, like, a lot to it. Like, I won't explain everything, but she yeah. meets those two guys, and she her mission is to get to her dad. Can I spoil it? Yeah. Um, yes? We can no? still watch it. It still has yeah, I'll still watch it so with spoilers. She, she eventually gets there, but she'd be suffering. She gets her finger cut off. Yo. Oh. They sew it back on, though. Oh. oh like, another one. Yeah. Another random finger. Yeah. yeah, and then the ghoul, he's the guy from the first clip. Hundreds of years later, he doesn't have a nose. He's he's like he's a dead body. He's a ghoul wow. from the sh from the games. And stuff. Yeah, but you're saying the care the female lead is lovable. 
Oh my god, yes. Yes? Yeah. That's she's all super I need cute to know. and her catchphrase, mm. she has this thing. She's like, okie dokie. Okay. Mm. And it's she has to cut someone's head off. And then <gasps> when she's about to do it, she just stares and it's like the camera and she's like, okie dokie. Oh like my god, you hear is the, the the saw. The zzz. She doesn't have the psychological trauma or anything. Well, she kind of has to do it. Oh, that's true. She's like, okie dokie, and then zzz, yeah. and that's where it ends in the wow. next episode. Thankfully, for once, the person isn't like, she's I very, can't do it. I'm scared. She's very like, cute and lovable, and she also played the games. Oh, the that's actual? true. Played the games, nice. and she knows nice. and everything and nice. the whole thing. Um, now I guess the bigger question is, does this show t- st- stay true to the video games? Well, in um, video games, there's no uh, interlocking there's story. No. It's always just... No, so not the story-wise, but it like... Is, it is canon. Yeah. But okay. this is after... Yeah, it's after. Like, way after all the bombings. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But they're keeping it true to the story. If them, that's they're the keeping thing it true to the That's the, the, the good thing games. about Fallout. Keeping Almost anything can be done and anything can happen. Yeah. But, like, keep, keeping it true to it being in that world? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So it, it is canon. They confirmed it is canon. Okay. Um. So at the very end, she does find her dad. Her dad is in some northern part of California. Whatever. Mm-hmm. Um. And she meets the main the lady who took him. Oh, yeah. By her. By the way, her mom's dead. Obviously. Okay. Her mom died, I think. They've always told her her mom died in the famine that happened. Yeah. It wasn't true. Ooh. So they wanted the dad because turns out the dad so vault 31 mm-hmm. 32 and 33 are connected we just never knew why oh. so vault 32 was where she lived but we come to find out that vault 31 is full of the people from 2077 in sleeping capsules oh. and her dad was one of those people oh my god so the, the main raider lady takes him because she needs like his fingerprint or something from him to activate like uh, infinite energy source for a city she's trying to build for people uh-huh. she's not trying to be mean but it's yeah. for the people um it turns out that the dad technically years ago that second bomb so there was a 2077 bomb and then there was another bomb years later the dad did that bomb oh <gasps> and then her mom was killed that bomb in that bomb oh Yo. my but God. plot twist her <laughs> mom's sitting there as a ghoul what? Yo. Yeah. This is cool. And then we know it's her mom because she has a necklace and it pans to the necklace and it's like right here. And her Charges. mom's like zombie ghoulish. The and, she, and she she sees that? She sees it. <gasps> Lucy's like right there. Oh my gosh. And then she tells this. the dad, she's like, just give her what she wants. And the dad does it. Um, And the city lights up, but then the there's like soldiers that come in and fight them. Uh-huh. So the main raider lady dies. Lucy shoots her mom because she doesn't want her suffering. And the dad disappears. So the, now the ghoul and Lucy are going to go find the dad to kill him, I'm assuming. And yeah. then they're going through tunnels and whatnot. And it pans to Vegas. <gasps> Let's go. Oh, Vegas? <laughs> Let's oh go. God. Wow. That's how it ends. I'm sorry. There's, no, there's a lot of more stuff that happens. but Yeah. No, but you sold it well. I, I, I want to watch it I want them to just explore some vaults too. Some she weird did. vaults. Some she vaults did. that had some weird shit. She did. Like the there was the rumors of the vaults that have one man, but f- like full, the rest Hundreds are women. Of women's or Ooh. one women, one a bunch of men. men. Damn. Of yeah. course they that do one. explore one vault. I don't. It's one thirty something they could explore. Yeah, they had so many vaults. They do weird ones where like this one's just full of cockroaches. This one's just full of lions. This one has this happening. This one has full of serial killers and one normal person. Yeah. But Jeez. the vault Lucy was in, they didn't know there was life upstairs. Oh. Like they were like, oh yeah, they did an announcement when she was getting married. She's like, oh yeah, her generation of kids is gonna be the one that gets to go up, up, upstairs. I call it upstairs. I don't know why, yeah. but <laughs> she, it makes they sense. were all excited. They were like, what? And then she finds out that there's people like on the surface, and you're like, what? Yeah. But then they go to the other vault, and the other vault is it, they accept people from the surface. Oh. So it's like, eh. so wait, uh, because I know nothing about Fallout. Why are there some people down there and some people living up? Because there was after. radioactive nuclear warfare, and some people survived up some top. Some people and survived some people up top. Had the membership like the, of Vault yeah, Tech and the, were able to the live underground. The Vault Tech to people safe. were the rich ones. Oh, there were the ones who bought a vault for their family and whatnot. But how did the ones up, like up, how you say upstairs, survived? <laughs> oh, that's just some people. Always just survived. some people survived. Oh, okay, like um, Maximus, he was in the second bombing and he survived because I think his mom put him in like a, in like a fridge. Wow. Like like that. Okay. Little, but there's also still radiation everywhere sometimes. Oh, yeah. There's radiation in the water and stuff yeah. like that. And so, in yeah. cola. New cola. The new cola. New cola. But there new was so many things cola. that were like, oh, my oh. God. Like the new yeah. cola that was shown in the show. And I was like, oh, my God. 
the little <laughs> pit boy and stuff like that. Yeah. 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 Okay. So what would you give it a rating? First season rating. Like an eight. Well, could, could you recommend it? What? Would you recommend it? Yeah. It's oh, good. Nice, it's nice, good. Nice. Even if you haven't seen the games yeah, or played, yeah. it's good. It's really good. That's the truth. And Fallout, you can almost okay, jump into any story. I'm going to say an eight because I feel like it was a little slow, but it did explain things well. Yeah. Like it, it has a lot of flashbacks for between the season. past and the present. Okay. So mm, for the first season, it's really good. It's really good. Really good. Okay, doggy. I'm just gonna say yeah. that. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Watch okay. It. All right. I'm Mads. Yeah. What You're up doing? next. Okay. Stellar Blade. Ex Literally. Machina? Yeah. I'm sorry. Literally Ex Machina. Released, <laughs> released like three days ago. Three it's days ago. Three to two days ago. And you're barely downloading. Ex Machina's barely been downloading. out though. Which, which, just. I'm heckling. You dumb. <laughs> Stop just bitch, over I'm here. Out, I should have. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Oh, she kept making fun of what <laughs> you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> bitch, you better be joking. I'm gonna keep this Calmados, up. Calmados. Mm. Calmados. Okay, wait. So it's obviously a game, right? Yes. You mm-hmm. can see the pictures. We're all thinking the same thing. She's hot. I mean, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> now, leading up to this game release, there was talks with the director and the people who made the game that it was gonna be very revealing. Mm-hmm. There was gonna be a lot of gore, even nudity, like even some of her outfits were kind of skimpy. Like Okay. First day it comes out, they send out a patch to censor all of that. Nah, how censor it? How though? her outfits are less skimmy. They've added, they've added oh, part layers to okay, it. Okay, what okay. was wrong with the, the outfits? The gore was brought down. Show Nothing. The boobies. <laughs> Nothing. But yeah, but what's wrong with that? Nothing. It's more like the argument that is now going on online about oh, it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And it's more like there are some people that are arguing that this is what they promised. There are some people that are arguing like you can't just be showing all that on a game and then not have it what? and then there's also the people oh. in the middle where i'm at where i'm like it's not really i'm not arguing in the fact of like whether it's okay or not uh-huh. i'm like i get why they did it i also don't like it mm-hmm. because they made that a point as a selling point uh, mm-hmm. okay uh-huh. and now they're coming back and fixing it on day one yeah like oh so they did they released it censored no they released it and gave then, it a day and then oh. censored all of it why though? I'd riot. No one, no, like, oh, no, one every, knows? Every, 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 no, like, they, the, uh, it I'm wasn't the sure director. I believe it was the company, like, Yo-fu? corporate, because even the director oh. was pissed about it. He was like, Yeah, it happened. He was not happy about it. Okay, but like, <laughs> yeah, big time. <laughs> you can't see the boobs and the butts. <laughs> yeah, but I, I wasn't gonna get the game for that reason anyway. Of course, of course. But like, <laughs> If you promise something, that, well, that's the thing too. It was like pro- not promised, but it was part of like. It, let's be honest, it was gonna be a part of it. No, okay. But I mean, once you release a game, just leave it. Yeah, but what about updates or fixing no, no, bugs? No, that's, separate. that's separate. These guys came in and literally. I see sent, some ass. It's like <laughs> I paid. <laughs> yeah. What if you were in there for like I paid sixty bucks to see the monster bleed when I stabbed it. Now they came in and like my monster does not bleed when you stab it. Oh, because they also removed gore. They removed gore. They what? removed outfits. They removed a lot of stuff. Can you return this? or censor it at all? Yes, you can return it if you haven't played it for two hours. There's some politics there. I don't mind. I, yeah, that's just, uh, <laughs> yeah. Like, there's no reason. These are stuff that like. But it's more. It. It's more based on the not the promise, but the you you sold it with this in mind. It's okay. We yeah. all have the we're all creepy about it or we're not creepy, <laughs> creepy about, about it. it. Some guys are just arguing like, dude, I paid for this game. I wanted to see her in that outfit. And then if you got the deluxe edition, it came with an outfit. Yeah. And now they're going back on the word saying, yeah, we're going to have to cover all that. So up. how does it look like now that it's censored? Let me just see if I can. Because I don't I don't think if anyone's posted an image. Yeah. Like, how does it look like? <laughs> all right. If see. you're compl- I think if you're a guy complaining about this. That, that's that. Yeah, <laughs> you got uh, you got some. No, no, don't do. I think I get what, what you're trying to say. Like, if you promise the game, just let it be. I mean, yeah. If you, it, oh, yeah. Like, let it be. Like, but like, <laughs> like that. A ver. Oh, that's not uh, going from that, like a low cut shirt I, to I suddenly an undershirt it. that covers all that. Okay, but okay, the her for showing her boobies. Her, her fighting boobies. her fighting her boobs out uh, fighting a mo- whatever she fights a monster a mech whatever like that's what 
that's the that's the to the, the guys sty- were that, upset. No, 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 just no. go watch X Machina. That's mm-hmm. the style of these video games. But it's like literally just adding a little bit of an extra cover from a bikini suit. Yeah. Like I get it's, why, but yeah. it's not that big of a deal either. Have they said why? Yeah, that, I don't well, no, it that wasn't. Bit. It wasn't the director or anything. It was more like the Ordeso corporate. Has, just, has have has a company said anything? As far as I know, no, no. statements. I mean, it is weird that they just yeah. out of nowhere decide to cover everything up. But like, maybe they're a conservative company and they hadn't actually seen the game like until this it one. came out. Yeah, she had. Le- she had. I Alex? think at first it was just legs. Now she has stockings, and it's a. It's yeah, more maybe it was a conservative company and they hadn't fully seen the game. <laughs> They hadn't had done a final review of the game, and then they were like, ah, oh, hold on. <laughs> yeah. All right, I got, I got like, Maybe. comments here from Reddit. Oh, <laughs> oh God, okay. It's very simple. People hate being lied to and were promised an uncensored game. Couple that with misleading promo footage, and you got massive issues. I'm sure it's a great game, but the trust is broken, and nothing will be the, the way of future patches. And it was Sony. Oh. 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 Wait, Sony? Then Sony no. didn't develop the game. Sony are the ones that are making the changes. That yeah. Jesus. I expect nothing more else than a bunny the, style uh, swimsuit was also. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, see, this is just the demographic you decided to piss off. And it was a Korean game. Y'all pissed off the wrong people. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Sony. You y'all can't gotta, promise these men and women and women. Yeah, women, women too. Uh, yeah, like you can't uh, a, a game a character like that and then just take it away from them. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, I don't mind it. I'm just like, okay, I wasn't gonna use that suit anyway. Okay, but let's. I don't go for like, it, the, I don't go for swimsuit suits. Like, not that it matters, but I would rather wear some like cool looking armor or like cool looking. Yeah, but outfit. like, yeah, but uh, they they is, lied. Is this a game that the, is the story good? Like, is yeah, it's you're an I think believe you're an android or what's called an angel, and you drop down on Earth and you're helping people in this whole civilization. Alita, the battle angel. Kind of. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Battle. But it's not, you're not an ancient fighting robot. You're more of something else. You're... It's more near Automata, Ooh. which also had its own controversies about it because you used to be able to look under her skirt. Mm-hmm. But instead of it being censored, she would just like, she, the character in game would just literally turn and look at you and be like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> like how, uh, how Norman Reedus would punch you if you kept looking at his crotch in the game. Yeah. On yeah. Death Stranding. It's like that. Yeah. And I'm like, y'all couldn't really just fucking, They could have you know, done that done that because if you look yeah. at those swimsuits yes it now covers more of her leg but it's like eh. i mean it doesn't matter to us but yeah. like you don't it, do that we're it's not, all not like, to a gaming community <laughs> it's like, like i don't know anything but you don't do that to you don't, these men and you women and children you don't promise children shit. don't say children i don't know man you don't <laughs> promise <laughs> you don't promise me the ability to see her naked and see the gore and then take it all away you don't want to sound, like sound like that guy. I don't want to sound like that guy, but I'm sounding like that guy. <laughs> For me, I'm okay it's, with it's that. Like, I mean, it is. I understand. Now get it. I understand yeah. if there's money involved. That's why these, you're paying sixty exactly. bucks. These these they probably guys. lost money doing this shit. They they <laughs> spent money on censoring. Exactly. That's true. Reworking all that and then po- patching it. Yeah. Someone had to do all that code. Damn. I got I got to disconnect my PlayStation before it updates. <laughs> 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 no, it's too late. It's already gonna download it yeah. with the game. I can't. Damn. I can't get the other version. Personally, I'd be upset. I'd be upset. I think, I'd be upset. I, I think you're. It's the, like like it's Lego a, games. Imagine they gave me that Lego Harry Potter, but they didn't. Inc- they would censor when they the Lego pops. And it, no, I'd be pissed. Yeah. Or it's more like they gave you Lego Harry Potter, but Hermione isn't in it. Disgusting. Cool. It's like it's the promise of something included in the game, and you're taking it away. Out of right. nowhere. Is it like if the Spider Man game if he doesn't the suddenly his webbing doesn't yeah. come out? They, they were they, suddenly he does webbing or they remove a suit, even though there was nothing wrong with it. Disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> or like suddenly <laughs> Miles is cut out. I <laughs> yeah. I should add that sound bite. Disgusting. 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 <laughs> but yeah, that's like it's it's two days out. I'd be already loving. like no one's even talking about whether it's good or not. <laughs> two yeah. days? Two I days it was out. like out, out. Like no. it's been a minute. No, it's been like two to three days. Just yeah, like I thought you were gonna talk about the story or something. I don't know the story. <laughs> <laughs> the gameplay looks cool. It's yeah. world, open it just, world, all that. It just that. sucks that but it's getting f- overshadowed by this problem. I'm pretty sure they had someone at the company that was pissed, and then they were like, <laughs> "Change <Yeah>. that shit." <laughs> I don't, and I even understand if it was like, "Oh, she's not old." Like it's a character that's 16. Like, mm-hmm. you could sexualize her, but you can't sexualize her too much because she is young. But yeah. she doesn't have an age. She's a robot or a fucking thing. 
Yeah. Someone complained. I'm 100% sure someone complained. Sony probably complained. Yeah. And they probably lost maybe maybe like a country was like don't post don't like you know how some countries censor shit. I understand it censoring in other countries. Yeah, but, but, but they did it for everyone. Is, yeah. They did it for oh. everyone. Yeah. Everywhere. They're gonna lose money. Well, all right. And it's like this game was gonna be really great from what I had seen. Well, you can still. I mean, yeah, give you can it still play you, it. you can still review it for us. Yeah, but it's more like I don't want to give my money to a company that promised me this and then didn't deliver. Because then that just encourages everyone to keep doing that. Like same thing with it's Kill the fun. Justice League, Marvel Avengers, any game that's come out in the last five years. True. Where it was promised to be this, but wasn't. Yeah. And they're like, oh, we'll fix it. Well, why don't you just, you know, get it right the first time? You're not wrong. Yeah. That's been happening a lot. See what Ow. I mean? <laughs> All right. But that's right. that's my that's my take on that, real quick. Bendy and Secrets of the Machine. Now. Before y'all wonder, what does this matter? Who gives a shit? Bendy's been done. <laughs> yeah. This he game bends? was released without a trailer or anything on f- April 14th. Now, oh, April 14th oh. is a special day in the Bendy story because it's a, uh, that's the date they always post something or the games come out or something happens. Uh-huh. This game had no re- no reveal or anything. It wasn't even released. What? It wasn't even released by the same company. He just dropped it. He just dropped it. Beautiful. But okay. not by what? the guys who made it. It what? was released released by another company called Gent Company. Is that allowed? Gent, G E N T. Yes, because that company is in the in the game as a as a story plot. Oh, well. Oh. And but, it, but they before this they had been teasing another game called Bendy the Cage, which is a story in between one and two. Mm-hmm. But now this one's Secrets of the Machine. And is, this the, is this that ink game you showed me? Yeah, the ink game that looks like if and it Mickey has that Mouse. One cute girl. W- she looks like a, like a little devil. Yeah, yeah, yeah Alice Angel. Oh, it's if like Mickey Mouse was possessed I by ship. Satan. I ship. I've seen the edits. <laughs> I ship. <laughs> you ship? Yeah. Ship who? The little girl. I don't know her name. An- An- Alice her Angel? And the other guy. The demon? No. Bendy? Bendy. Bendy. Bendy's. Bendy. Bendy's there's so a many. Dog. There's a lot of edits. There's edits. <laughs> there, yeah, you can't. You know that. Well, happen. no, yeah. Well, yeah. And then there was also the theories on that. But the point is, it's a prequel of it. All of it. Ooh. Oh. Now I have not played it. <laughs> I don't oh know shit. God, I don't play play <laughs> For real? Why, why are you, we here? Why did you ask me to put it? Because I love Bendy. Hey, bitch, you better be joking. Because <laughs> it brought me and my sister together. <laughs> Aww. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> you don't even know the story. What's the story? This what is, is the, the story? The story is that an ink machine literally for some reason has the powers to bring ink monsters to life. And that's beautiful. And that's beautiful. And <laughs> this guy named Joey Drew took advantage of that and used that to turn people into mon- ink monsters. And then someone comes in and stops all that. But now the gent company has now taken over the ink machine. And now we're wondering where the fuck is this all going to go? What's the story of this game? It's a prequel to all that. Is this how the machine started? In a way, it's said to be. But Ooh. I... The it, first exorcism. So no. wait, so if it was if it's not by the official studio, where can you get it? Oh no, you can buy it anywhere. But the thing oh, is, anywhere? the studio that made it is called Gent Studios or Gent Company. And there's like no problems. Well, it's not a real company. It's a company in game. In oh. the game, there's Joey Juice Studios, the company that makes Bendy the Demon. Mm-hmm. animations right yeah because it's all part of mickey mouse show shit mm-hmm. ben, joey's drew studios is the guys who make the animations oh. jen was the guys who made the machine and all the all the updates to it to make it easier to work oh. and those two companies work together to make bendy animation shows mm-hmm. and now jen has come out with this game and it's like oh and usually joey drew studios the youtube page would post about all these things but now it's this other thing called Gent posting about all these things with this game. Oh, but it's the same studio. Making. It's the same studio. Oh. It's just a cool way to advertise oh, it all. Okay, so oh, okay. There's not no legal issue. There's yeah, no yeah, real yeah, life yeah. Gent company. Okay, I get you. That's a smart way to market it. Then it's That's just it inter- is. especially because now technically after the f- after the finale of the second game, Gent has taken over the ink machine again. They mm-hmm. have it again, and they can still be used to bring back the demon. And Why bring do I want to play this? I want to play this. It's a scary game. That's fine. I have it. That's fine. All right, mm-hmm. I'll make you play it. I'll watch. <laughs> <laughs> all right, but I, you should play this one and tell us what. I kind of want to play it. I this game or all the games? There's this one, three. This one. No, this one. This one, because it's one? a prequel. There's also a mobile game. 
<laughs> She'll play that one. Hold on. <laughs> Boris something. Hold on. Benny and the Imagishing Boris's <laughs> run or something. And it's like a dungeon runner. Today. It's literally like a dungeon runner. So, yeah. I'll probably play that. Okay. I don't know if it's still out, actually. Mm. Are you going to play it, though? Maybe. <laughs> it's a scary game. I don't I do not do that shit by myself. <laughs> Next paycheck. <laughs> Next paycheck. But that's that's all I got. Yeah, that. Okay. Now, moving Let's on. Go! <laughs> hold on, hold on. <laughs> Taylor Swift released a video game. Dura. <laughs> pop culture. All right, Dura. we've added, video game? We've added a pop pop culture slide. I am going to. This is where intern shines. I am going to explain my experience with this. Okay. Um, I forgot what day she released it, but <laughs> it was last week. Oh, it was. Okay, so I'm not that far behind. It was last week. It was. It was somewhere along the past week or two. Okay. So. <laughs> She was supposed to drop it, I think, our time, like, 8 p.m., and I completely forgot, uh-huh. and I listened to it, like, at 10. Oh. And the first one, it's always, like, an hour, so I was like, oh, I'll finish it at yeah. around 11, 12, because I took a break. Because I, I have to look at the lyrics when she releases Oh, yeah, something. I do that, too, yeah. So then it's, like, whatever, and then one of my friends was like, hey, like, she has a countdown on her Instagram story, and we're like, that mm-hmm. doesn't make sense, because she already released it. Yeah. But she had a countdown, and we're like, okay, whatever. So I listened to the first thing, whatever, and then my friend was like, the countdown's gone. Oh. We're like, check Twitter, check Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch did a double album release. Oh, <gasps> what? 31 songs. Oh my gosh. That's 31 crazy. 31 songs. Wow, that's crazy. It was beautiful. Damn. But no one, ex- I mean, the, the theorists, of I don't course, know what yes. they're called. Yeah. They, they the- had, they knew. Damn. Or it was like a big speculation. Wait, so these are 32 new songs. 31 new songs. Oh, 31. Wow. So it's not like the one she was re-recording of Taylor's version? No, no, version? no. That's a whole separate thing. Wow. 31 songs. What? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I need to squeak. Um, so 31 new songs. Um, Damn. People, and then we, we thought it was going to be about Joe. Joe was the last guy she broke up with. Uh-huh, they yeah. were together for six years. It was not. Oh. It was, but it wasn't. Yeah. It was about Maddie. Maddie Healy from the 1975 Okay. It was about Joe Arwin. There were some songs about Travis. Tra- <laughs> Travis. Um, what is that his name? Travis. The football? Travis Kelsey? Oh, yeah, Travis. Him. Cheese. There yeah. were songs about him. Wow. She dissed Kim Kardashian. What did she say, though? The song is called... Just to be clear, that is not her statements. These are just say- okay. these are so our speculations. These are, yeah, these are fan speculations, but of course. I'm going to show you. The song she did for Kim Kardashian is called... What was it called? Your do- mother? No. Or? Um, your mother? <laughs> your mother? Dogma? Dogma? Dogma. <laughs> <laughs> I just take so, okay, so when she first released it, it was called the Tortured Poets Department. Yeah. And then when she oh. did that midnight release, it turned into the Tortured Poets Department, the anthology. Oh my gosh. So the song with... Um, These are like Bible entries. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the song for Kim Kardashian is called Thank You, Amy. The oh. K, the I, and the M are capitalized. Show, show her the name. Show her Here. The name. Let me see. Where is it? There. Oh. Yeah, that's... Yeah. Thank you, Amy. So what is the song about? What is it saying? Kim Kardashian? No, no, no. What are, like, but so, like, um, what are some lyrics? Like, there's a lyric at the very end where she's like, one day your kid will run into the house um, singing a song that you and I both know it was about you. Whoa. And she said that because North is like the biggest Taylor Swift stan. Yep. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Damn. And then she also was like, my mom, my mother's a saintly woman, but she wished that she were dead. Wow. Yeah. It was, it, it, I, I made it him hit, listen it to hit it. It hard. Damn. Yeah. There was, there was, oh my God. Why is she, wonder why she did that though. I think people I mean, were she saying, because she was re-recording, well, the rumors, She's re-recording her Reputation album. Oh, she has to do that one too? Yeah, she's she's doing that one. I don't know when, but she's doing it. Um, And people were saying that the feelings came back. Oh, from yeah. From when all that Kanye yeah, stuff was happening. Yeah, because that was crazy. I remember when that happened. It's like, is this the end of her? Yeah, and then here, here's my reaction. I sent it to him, and I was like, look, Taylor dropped. <laughs> <laughs> so and then, she, what song is it? She um, left me for two hours. I, I was like, yeah. She left you for two hours. So two there's hours. the... First lyric that got us was at dinner you take my ring off my middle finger and put it on the one people put wedding rings on and that's the closest I've come to my heart exploding. 
Oh my gosh. Joe Count Your Days. Is oh that wasn't with Kels? No, that was about Joe. Which one's Joe? The Joe one she, Arwin. Is it the one? That's she the one did? she dated for six years. Oh, so the one before Kels. Yeah. Okay. Well, actually, no, because after Joe, she was with Maddie Healy. Maddie, that's the one that she was with. Nineteen seventy. That was very brief. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, very but it brief. Was very hurtful. It was very hurtful. He's a dickhead. Yeah. Damn. She made a song for him called "Um, The Smallest Man Who Ever Lived." Damn. That. Oh wow! I'm not even a man, yeah. and that hurt me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> she. Anyways, I don't have a favorite song, but really, it was so good. Like I'm a fan. I'm not a diehard fan. Yeah. Bitch can write. The oh, bitch of can course. write. I can. I'm Every not... time she releases an album, I learn a new English word I did not know. Jesus. <laughs> like, it's good. Wow, that's crazy. It is really fucking good. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard so many songs. Yo. And Posty yeah. was in it. Fuck yeah, he was. <laughs> Posty was in it. Um, I don't know. This is just so okay, much. So to I, talk I, about. Haven't, I haven't seen it, but the trailer, the trailer, um, I'm oh, sorry, not the trailer. I just saw a picture of her with Post Malone's tattoos. Have you guys seen the music video? It's really good. It's good. <laughs> we were there. <laughs> we were there. So it's just her. It's a, it's a Taylor Swift and Posty era. Oh, kind of. And I'm li- I'm here for it. Austin, the the poets, the suffrage poets decided whatever. Mm. So in the video, it's posting her, and she has like everyone's like, "Who the hell is that?" If you know, you know. <laughs> um at the video she's getting like experimented on or something like that i don't really understand it it's two of the guys from the movie dead poet society oh my and God. get it and she's like to my she's like for my tortured poets from my dead poets or something like that wow i'm like bro that's beautiful <laughs> i wish robert williams had heard that dude oh my gosh the point is the album slaps. <laughs> she roasted and made a good album. <laughs> it's a really sad one, but it's good at the same time. Fortnite. That's Fortnite was good. That one was good with Posty. She also has another song. Oh, there's a song called But Daddy, I Love Him. By who? It's called But Daddy, I Love Him. By That's Taylor. A song. Oh. And the song is just like, it's it's very spirited. And then all of a sudden, she gagged a lot of fans because in the in the song she says, but I'm having his baby. Everyone's like, oh. hold on. And then she said, I'm not, but you should see the look on your faces. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> she gagged us. Oh, my God. She went, oh, never mind. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Damn. But she just has really good songs. Wait, so you listen to all 32? Two hours. Damn. Damn. A, that was fast. Oh. Damn. I started up again at midnight and I finished up. And then I hour. lost, you know, I lost a partner for like, those two hours <laughs> i even questioned whether to bring her back or not let her back in yeah no you didn't i did i made a whole thing about it <laughs> of course you like, did i don't know if i want this again what if she releases another album <laughs> <laughs> no it'll just be her reputation one we've already heard that one but what if she's no, cooking you more? should be worried when harry releases something. oh my god when uh, harry releases something out of nowhere like if harry releases a sad boy album i'm done for. <gasps> i or, might uh, actually like that too or country oh my god no that's posty <laughs> anyways I don't have a favorite song. Really? There's there's 31. But like. Not one slaps. You have to have one that you like. You would like. They're oh, all too good. They're all good. Um, I mean, I hearted a few, but it's just like, oh, my God, that one, that mm-hmm. one hit a little more. Yeah. Oh, and one thing that people thought is that she's not going to. So her past music, she released all too well. Ten minute version. This is Jake Gyllenhaal. That mm-hmm. man thought he was safe. The man thought he was free, so he released Roadhouse. Oh, well. <laughs> he was <laughs> not. She roasted him in this album too. Yeah, oh my God. the last song, the literally last called one. the manuscript. Oh my, it's about gosh. Jake Gyllenhaal, or so it's rumored. These are all rumored, not Again, actual. It's not. Com- it will never be confirmed by her. Cause, yeah, uh, she would never. Because lawyers are strong. Mm-hmm. Her fans are like no. Mm-hmm. It's Jake Gyllenhaal. The man wasn't safe. <laughs> the man got clapped at the end. Very. Damn. She. She. She, um, what's it called? Just throughout the whole album, it was just... Emotional! Yo, <laughs> for real. Um, she, she calls, she doesn't call him out. She shouts out Charlie Puth. Yeah. Randomly. 
Why? In a good way. In a good way. She, I guess she was reminiscing. And she's like, we we both thought Charlie Puth should be a bigger celebrity than he should be. And I was like. Then he is. I'm like, he is. I mean, he's talented, but I've heard some things about his character. Yeah, but there, yeah, she like just shouts him out and the memes were beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know. Yeah. Um, I think maybe my favorite one is. Sorry. She sure chokes a lot over here. <laughs> she has a song called L O M L. What does L O M L O M L mean to you guys? L O M L. L O M L. Love of my life. All right. L O L O M L. What does that mean? L you said it. M L. Yeah, love of my life. All right. Well, it's called loss of my life. <gasps> wow. That that could also be good. Yeah. Though. She switched it to loss of my life. Does she say who's the? Is it like saying I the best loss or that the worst? one is about Joe? Oh. Was he that good? What was he that good? Was he a good partner? He was a dickhead too. Then why is it a loss? Six years. That's a good point. Damn, six. I love it. <laughs> I, love it. I mean, that's yeah. all I'm gonna say. There's like too much. If you want to deep dive into this, this could be a whole podcast. It could be a whole no. conspiracy. I feel it, it would be thing. better for you if I knew more, but like I don't know. Like it's a whole I, thing. I don't know nothing about. There's Taylor's one, uh, so long London. She's saying goodbye to Lon- London. He was British. Mm-hmm. She talks about how she waited for him at the altar. He oh. basically couldn't commit. Wow. Imagine you can't commit to Taylor Swift. Which one was that one? Can Joe. That then oh. brings the question: like, what is it about Taylor that finds these guys and then suddenly just does, doesn't work out? Like, I don't know if it's her at this point, or if it's him, or like, is it her tastes? Not to comment on it, like, oh, it has... I think with Joe, I feel like she would have been endgame with him, but it was the fact that she waited six years and the man couldn't commit. You know, what pisses me off is all mm-hmm. the time you fucking Taylor Swift people use all these phrasings. What? <laughs> endgame with him? The fuck is that? Everyone says Everyone that. Everyone says no. that. Yeah. Everyone uses that as a, as a like, a... What? You know, you know what's also crazy? You fucking Taylor Swift fans outside the stadium suddenly hear that one song and burst out into okay, tears. Okay, that was hilarious. That was hilarious. I'm sorry. I, I wouldn't do that. You don't want... Don't want to... She's like, You're she's on crying. record now saying you fucking Taylor Swift fans. You're on record saying that now. Yeah, the fans. I still enjoy her music. Taylor Swift I can fans, still hate on fans. I'm a fan, just not true. one of those. Like Taylor Swift yeah, fans yeah. are a whole species of people, and I respect them. Like, I understand feeling very strong emotions about a song. Yes, but I'm not going to burst out into tears over the, the memory of it. I'll show you the video in a little okay. bit. It's a TikTok, and these three girls are sitting outside the stadium. Because they didn't get tickets. Because they didn't get tickets. And then she starts doing this one song, and the, all three friends are look, uh, looking at the middle, and the middle one. <laughs> okay, well, they clearly have made connections to their lives yeah, to that I mean, song. You, you, will, do it. you have your get own over way. It. You have no, your own artist. Get they over do it with it. Taylor. You have your own. It might not even be a get, song, but you even it. anything else. You have connections Move like on that. with your life. <laughs> Jeez. So as soon as the album was done for, you know, people mm-hmm. and the edits. Oh, yes. Of there course. was so many Hunger Game edits. <laughs> <laughs> so many Hunger Game edits. It was wow. beautiful. But this was my favorite one. To the It says, just listen to the song So Long London. They put Joe's face like he was a tribute, a dead tribute. No. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! Wait, let me see Joe. And she hearted it. She found someone's Instagram post and hearted it. Eighty nine. Let me see. Like they just did that. Wow. Uh, you Joe. know when they killed them in the Hunger Games, they yeah. put their picture up at the night. Yeah. Damn. But wow, that's yeah, crazy. Thirty one songs in the middle of a tour. Wow. Fucking She's amazing, still not though. done touring. She's still not done touring. She's back to touring on the ninth. Wow. Where is she going now? I think Europe. She's well, like Europe. She just finished Japan. She's going to Europe. But yeah, in the Dang. middle of tour, and I think she's going to add it to the set. So people are trying to get tickets. That's crazy. That makes sense. Yeah, it does make sense, but it is. See, crazy. I hate The show's already three hours. No, I don't know what the hell she's going to do. I don't, I don't like when artists released albums in the middle of touring because then the ones that went before. They're going to get the new. They're not going to get the new stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I, I hate, hate when that, that happens. Happens. <laughs> but, um,. <laughs> Yeah. Wow. It was good. Bitch can write. I want more. She's going to have <laughs> I more. Want this more. brought me back 30 to the... So- 31 this, songs This brought me back more? to the fandom. I was like, I understand why I left. I also understand why I'm back. 
and uh, I'm here to stay. I'm mm. here to stay. <laughs> and I've never Harry releases. I've while. never been there <laughs> until Harold releases. I I'm will still be on. Here. I'm still on Austin with Post Malone, man. That that, that's good, good too. That I'm not, no good. one's saying that's not. No, I know. I'm just like I haven't moved on yet. <laughs> <laughs> How fun. yeah, my kid, my tooth. All right. Oh wait, would you give it a rating? <gasps> it was too oh, much. Yeah. <laughs> we're just, we're just gonna. Emotional. I damage. guess we'll never know. Damn, that was her. That's yours now. I, I guess we'll never know. I really use Kanye on a you Taylor. Oh, Ooh. you're going to hell. <laughs> <laughs> move on. Move on. Move on. Emotional damage. <laughs> All right, we're moving. Moving on, on to. Where am I? Um, Eminem releasing that new album in the summer. The oh, death. So we have, do we have a date? Shade. Oh, do we no, have a date? I didn't actually look that up. Oh my goodness! On tw- April twenty fifth, the Grammys announced that he, the Grammy announced that he would release his twenty fifth, twenty eleventh, twentieth what twentieth stu- studio what album, about? the death of Slim Shady, Coupe de Gras, this summer. Coupe de Gras. Coupe de Gras. The um, death. It says summer, so I'm assuming June, Damn. July, or August. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I don't think anyone's ready. I wonder, is he going to roast people again? Is he just going to yeah, roast never, I never thought he would even think of that type of title. Summer. I thought he was like so proud of some shady. Oh, yeah, it's a double edged sword. Yeah. Because well, like, yeah. it was Eminem who did good songs, and then Slim Shady did the mean shit. Yeah. And yeah. the traumatic shit. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. And he. It's an alter ego. He used Slim Shady, I think, to roast. Uh, who was it? Oh, Christina Aguilera, Mariah Carey. Yeah. I think, but the most yeah. recent one, I think, was Nick Cannon, maybe? Oh, Machine Gun Kelly, Nick no. Cannon. No, no, he no. Machine Gun Kelly was Eminem. That, he, that was him. He's like, that's me. Oh, Eminem? Yeah. yeah. Oh, but to, oh, for Slim, Slim Shady. Slim Shady's an alter ego that he uses. Yeah. But he is now killing Slim Shady. <gasps> it has come. I have no idea how this is going to even sound. The end of an era. I hope he has like features. Big oh, time. yeah. Who do you think would be on it? No, I I'm don't think. Post Kendrick. Kendrick. Kendrick also came out with. Please. He released 15 tracks, but I haven't found him. That was like an hour ago. Yeah. <laughs> but Kendrick was... also. Fuck the big three. It's just the big. Yeah. Movie. It's like, yo. Damn. I hope he brings features. Like if him and Kendrick cool. were together, no one's fucking safe, bro. Dude. Run. <laughs> Run. I know. Be like, good luck, Drake. Good luck, Drake. J. Cole, everybody. Because yeah. J. Cole recently apologized on in a concert to Kendrick. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He did. He did. He did. He didn't feel like it was necessary. It wasn't. But, you know, <laughs> it's whatever. just, I just never heard of that, of a rapper saying sorry. Mm. But well, yeah. J. Cole's cool. Of, oh, we all love J. Cole, but like. Yeah. But no, uh, name me another rapper that would apologize after a diss. We're having a whole listening party to Eminem. Well, <laughs> I'm down. Eminem dude. apologized to Tyler, I think. I have no idea who this man has apologized to. I don't think Eminem has ever apologized to anyone. I just hope Eminem apologized to Taylor the Creator about the roast about Taylor create nothing because he's Tyler the Creator. Bruh. <laughs> oh. But well, it was because, it was yeah. you know. I just, I wonder what's going to happen in this album. Because the last one, music to be murdered by, fuck. Yeah, that, but that was to Machine Gun Kelly, right? That was to a whole bunch of people. He just had kill shot. But on it was one. mainly Machine Gun Kelly. No, he had one track. A big one. Yeah, but then also <laughs> in that same track, he went yeah, against. Yeah, he went against. He went against, against Charlemagne, not Charlemagne. Charlemagne. Uh, Charlemagne, yeah, not Timothy, the other Charlemagne, <laughs> <laughs> the one who has that as a nickname. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But no, he's. I'm wondering if he's gonna roast people again, or is it gonna be another? I good think he's album? roasting Maybe himself. He's gonna roast himself. Like because yeah. Slim Shady used to always. This man roast is unroastable. M&M. Por eso, this man's like unroastable. So yeah. he's probably gonna do it, so no one okay, else can do it. You know how NF kind of talks to himself in raps? Yeah. Like I don't know if you've heard Intro Three. Yeah. He does. Um, well, he was like talking back and forth with himself, and yeah. at the end, he like kills kills himself with a shovel. Yeah, yeah. What if that's what if that's the I type of like thing Eminem whole, will do? This whole album is just Eminem roasting Slim Shady, and then Slim Shady releases his album to roast Eminem. Oh my god! Like Eminem's yeah, like, like I'm tired of getting Eminem. hit by these little punches. I want to sock myself <laughs> just to feel <laughs> no, something. No, I feel again. like yeah, I think it'll be that. Like I'm gonna roast myself so y'all can't do it. Or more like, because y'all can't do it right. Like an eight mile on Eminem. Yeah. On the, yeah. Sorry, on like, Slim Shady. He's like, like I'm going to do it on my show. Let me you guys how to roast me, because y'all can't seem to get it right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I feel like it'll be that. Who and has roasted Eminem? Nick Cannon. They tried. Oh, yeah, yeah, they tried. Uh, like, I've Machine seen a lot Gun of tried. Kelly, I'm saying successfully. Benzino. No one. No one. Like, Machine Gun Kelly was 
Like the song was there. This man but will then release Eminem a whole re- single to get back at you. Yeah, but then Eminem <laughs> yeah. released one track and it was like some people were like, That's "No, done. Machine Gun He'll Kelly won." Like, and get money out of it. <laughs> yeah. Machine Gun Kelly did not win that fight. Mm-hmm. No, no, no. Even though Machine Gun Kelly later in interviews would say, "I heard that shit," and then I put well, my shit away. You don't like, fuck I, with his like, daughter. That shit wasn't hard. Like yeah. Machine Gun tried to act like you don't it, fuck with his daughter. When it came out, he tried to act hard, but then out later, no, he like Kill Shot, he was just like, "That shit didn't hurt at all." Then it the did. Homie became an emo boy. <laughs> Damn. Well, you don't mess with his daughter. True. Don't True. talk shit about ha- Haley. <laughs> yeah. So just like, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. We, we can't wait. The last topic of the day. Something y'all got to talk about. No! Why that picture? Oh, my God. Why that picture? I don't know why y'all roasting Benny so hard. No, no one's roasting anything. Benny. Oh, this is for this is for you. This is your. Mm-hmm. This is where you're going to This shine. is not my topic. You wanted to no, talk about you this. you both no, no, wanted no. to talk about this. You said you wait, had some things to say. Wait, why did you say that picture? It's just like awkward. <laughs> There, okay, there was a prettier one shot of them, but like it, I couldn't say it because it wasn't JPEG. So that's like, this is the best you could get. <laughs> this is mm, oh. this is where you are gonna shine. I am not shining. I want to hear I your don't comments. Wanna, okay, mira. Um, <laughs> What's your opinion on Benny Blanco and Selena Gomez? Um, spill the tea. It's hard. Don't shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, girl. It's because okay. How is it hard? She's happy. That's what's. That's why it's hard. She's not supposed to be. No, 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 no. <laughs> he said, "I wish nothing but evil. blessings onto this woman." <laughs> Someone with her caliber type of of fame. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'll let, go ahead. Continue. Shut the fuck up. I let me talk. I already saw your fucking face. You already have a fucking opinion. My, my okay? eyes rolled so fucking hard. <laughs> I'm sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. You would want her to be with someone more to her level. Not to her, her finish. not to her level. Okay, but just someone that matches her. Uh, no, ben? I don't know the word. It's well, like what are we looking for? I don't want to say it. Just say it. <laughs> you just know what it. I'm trying say to it. say. No, just say, just say it. Cause no, cause it's fucking rude. That's so. Say it. Cause you want someone with her more the the same type of beauty she has. <laughs> you want so you want someone that's to her level. Okay. No, like, no, 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 that's kind See, of like the, the gist of it. See, that's the thing, because if he, you just saw his skills, this man's a genius. Oh no, yeah, obviously he's yeah. a great producer. But but his face is god damn. <laughs> See, and that's I don't care if she's happy. She found an ugly boy. Hey, it's always the ugly boys that be hurting people the most. So sometimes they fuck. All, why is this hate against ugly boys? We're already I'm ugly. Not gonna lie. Okay, she's not wrong. I'm not wrong. But she's also Billy Irish. Billy Eilish Billie Eilish literally Eilish said, fucking, no. if you give an ugly boy no. a chance, it goes to their head. No, that is true. Hey, no, no, no. I'm not she saying has it's a gonna point. happen. She has a point there. You dumb. <laughs> no, no, no. Bitch, I'm gonna no. Fuck no, this is annoying. What <laughs> oh is this hate God. on ugly boys? We don't get shit. We're already you ugly. You say we. You're not part of that community. Yes, I am. Okay. <laughs> You're not ugly. Okay, well, I guess I'm, I'm still defending them. <laughs> okay. Why? I'm defending them. Because look, they don't get shit. They're already ugly. They have to depend on their comedy. <laughs> okay. And sometimes uh, that doesn't even hit. I'm not their comedy. They're just their character. Okay, and who says pretty boys got okay, any... Okay, I'm just saying, sometimes it goes to their head. I'm not saying it's gonna happen. Of course it's gonna look, go... Okay, look. Think about it. They look, just okay. got a okay. pretty girl. Exactly. We don't but... know, though. Some. What if you just got Harry Styles out of nowhere? Would you not feel confident? Dude, hell yeah. See? <laughs> that's different! Now, okay. whether they cheat or not, Listen, that's besides the point. In mm. my opinion... If she wants to be with him, as long as she's happy, Good because for her. this woman has suffered with toxic relationships. A lot. So and you know what's her biggest toxic relationship? Her fans. Not you. <laughs> not okay, you no, no. And I agree with you. You're because not wrong, yeah. I follow so many of her fan accounts. Yes. Not one of them love this man. That's oh, fair. No. There is not one. Uh, like, I've followed these people for years. They, yeah. No one likes this guy. Okay. And I'm like... Why would you guys prefer her to be in a relationship with a weenie? With, with a yeah, pretty with, boy that she doesn't love the same way. She mm. loves them, but she the she is not receiving the same love back. Yeah. It's just all toxic. So if this is good for her, then I'm happy for her. Yeah. I am not going to... Tell her not to do it or anything yeah, like I'm that. Yeah, I'm not going to... What am I going to... I win nothing from here. Uh, I, I win nothing sitting here hating on this guy because... 
this guy's the one that's winning. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know what I think but it like, is? I just feel no one. What? <laughs> She's got Selena's got the attention that um, Kim and Kylie want. <laughs> where it's not on their scale. I mean, they it's don't not, like her. No, yeah, yeah, but yeah. No, that's yeah. not. That's besides the point. It's on. She, Selena Gomez, doesn't have to do anything, but people will still focus on her. Yeah, because she for has whatever class reason. and grace. Yeah, yeah. but like <laughs> Kylie and Kim have to release makeup. They have do, ass, do, not class. Okay, a fake you're ass. You're missing the point. The point is, <laughs> she, Selena Gomez gets attention when she doesn't want it. Kim and, and yeah. other girl and Kylie and all them have to fucking do something to get they the attention. They have to work for it. Yeah. Yeah. For Selena attention. Gomez could just start dating Benny Blanco and suddenly it's the topic everyone wants to talk about. Yeah, Everyone's you, wondering yeah. why you're, and all that. Right. And I'm just like, holy shit. Poor girl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know Benny Blanco could make her feel like a queen and yeah, amazing. Yeah, I mean, he does. And he does. And he does. And he does. He's been but on a few But just podcasts. because he does look fugly makes it a bad thing. We're See, not... If this man looks different... And I'm saying you two are saying that. I'm saying it as from what I've seen from fan reactions. I'm just saying it doesn't get to his head. Are you hoping hope, it doesn't? I get what, yeah. you're, I get what you're saying. I just hope it doesn't. It just sucks that... Because um, he's talked about her and he's like, oh, like she's doing charity work with me. Because she's like, look at me. And the guy who was on the podcast is like, yeah, but you're a really great guy. Like, I love your personality. And Your personality? Um, Benny was like, yeah, but don't say that. They're going to cancel you. He's like, and? He's like, I don't care. Yeah. So I just hope it doesn't get to his head. Look... Maybe. It just sucks that society is so focused on look. beauty and looks. Because mm-hmm. if this man would look different, we, we would be having this conversation. And True. that's what sucks. <laughs> but uh, looking at <laughs> them together, like right there, they don't look. Yeah. She looks 10 times better than him, yes. But it looks good. It's no, like no, no. any Adam Sandler movie. I oh had, my God. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah. An like, Adam God. Sandler movie. But Adam Sandler didn't look that bad. Yeah, but when, <laughs> with the times. people he'd be pairing himself with. Oh, true, true. Like Jennifer Yama. Aniston. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. You're oh right. my God. And I love Adam Sandler. Yeah. Yeah. But that's different. And I like <laughs> I like Benny Blanco. Yeah, he's funny. But he's like, hilarious. I, 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 I would have never thought that right? you, Selena you would have date seen Benny. It from a no, time miles never. away. But I will say when they collabed like two years ago, mm-hmm. because he made us, she made a song with him. Yeah. yeah, their chemistry was 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 like there on par there, and people mm-hmm. would say like right then there, I saw fans saying um, like uh, uh they they see the chemistry, but people were like hell no, she can do better. Okay. From that, just them no, she, speculating. She, she, Anyone she can. Didn't, she, yeah. Yeah. It's so. like the people always say they can do better. This can do be better. Like okay. Yeah, but, but again, it's happy? their choice. It's are they happy? Yeah. Then cool. They're fucking millionaires. If I was paying her bills, yeah, I'd be all up on about that. She's like, no, you can't <laughs> date them. Go play. Selena could have released a single sound, a song right now at the same time as they announced that they were dating. The dating thing would still be bigger. Yeah. No, and that's, that's what and sucks. that is whatever happens with them happens. Oh, if he breaks up with her, holy shit. Um, what what if she breaks out- up with him? That's that's, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! If, if anything comes out about him cheating or anything like I that, I swear to God, I can't defend yes. ugly boys no more. <laughs> I will <laughs> be on here saying you don't give ugly boys a chance. Oh my god! And I'll gosh. be like, Billie Eilish really pissed me off with that statement. <laughs> but she's not wrong. She wait, what is wrong. Billie, wait, what did Billie? Eilish she said that she said like, you give ugly boys a chance. They and think they roll. They, they think they roll the world. world. Oh yeah, I've heard her say that. Okay, so as an ugly bar, you're not allowed but to like, build yourself up I'm after a, I'm happily give... getting a beautiful woman. Yeah, but it gets to, like, oh, when they cheat on a pretty girl. Like, really? That's, that's like a whole that. other situation. That, I feel like that's what she meant. Or when it goes to their hit. I think Benny is has a good head on his shoulders. Yeah. That's so I'm going to give but him a chance. Billy Eilish, I'm like, yo, you're, like, I don't know when okay, she said Billie this. Eilish I feel like this dating. happened when she was dating, like, a 16-year-old boy. Yeah, she's, she's dating so young. I'm like, this um, makes yeah, no she's, sense. She's, she's, she's lesbian now, I think. Oh, Billy, yeah. All right. If it goes wrong, you will, boys are so I will I will, That's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to say. I will have a, a, a conference room ready for uh, my speech. I'm just like, fuck, you just proved Billy right. If he really fucks it up and, like, he cheats. Like, it's one thing if he, she breaks up with him, but, like, if he cheats, he fucking breaks her heart or he does the anything. Fans are he are riding is, a dawn. He is dead. <laughs> and not even fans. for me. He's just, I know he's going to be fucking crucified. The fans are going to ride at dawn. They will ride at dawn. Mm-hmm. And, Fuck. I'm just going to be like, well, so much for defending ugly dudes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But that's been Nerds with a Cider Fries. We haven't done two hours in a while. We haven't. I don't think we've ever done two hours. Well, you oh. have been gone for a while. Yeah, guys, about that. It was because I was getting a vasectomy and an asshole removed. <laughs> <laughs> well, how do you poop? I don't want to talk about it. 
All right. My mouth is now an entry and an exit. Do we have an outro? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that. <laughs> Remember, guys, if you're in the forest, go with the bear. <laughs> <laughs> Do not go with the man. The okay. bear will eat you in one bite and follow you'll be dead. Follow the bear. We'll follow, follow the, the bear. man. Sing and get the bear to offend you against the man. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> and then we will make a movie about it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This has been Nerds of the Side of Fries where we come once a week or not at all. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> we well, will see you in the next five to three weeks. No, we'll see you in the next week. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye.